Hello everyone, and welcome back to another Howler for an Hour. Today we're checking out Curse of the Sea Rats, which you guys might recognize as familiar because we actually checked out a demo of this like a year ago when it was still in development. Well, it just got finished up and the embargo for it just lifted today. It hasn't released yet, so I'm getting an early look at this game now. This is a Metroidvania style game with four playable characters and upgrade systems. And also it's completely centered around the idea of Everybody was seafaring people and then they got turned into rats and now everybody's running around as a rat doing rat things and trying to stop the bad rats Rat TF <laughs> a lot of rat TF so uh, I'm sure this will be to the liking of some people here part of the reason I wanted to play it But also the demo was pretty cool didn't give me enough to play for me to form a full impression I want to check out more of it and see how they've improved things so let's see how this full release does it also has local co-op So I also have Esler here. Hello and this is us restarting a second time because we tried to get him on Bluetooth headphones and it broke my audio. Because anything breaks my audio if it's too complicated. Please get an audio jack headset set or something so it doesn't mess with the audio. Uh, but yeah, we have a we have a weird sound set up here. So if anything sounds a little different, that's why. Let us know if it gets too weird or whatever. The speakers are also slightly on so he can hear the game audio a little bit. But it should be fine. Uh, just let us know as we go. But uh, before we begin, if you like the video, do think about giving a like. If you haven't subscribed yet, think about doing that as well. But if you really want to help out, think about coming over to Twitch. We're trying to reach partner over here, but we need more viewers to do it. So if you want to come by, whether it's a lurk or a talk, think about doing so because it really does help out immensely. This is our first game today, and we're at, we just hit 40 viewers. It was just at 39, now we're at 40. That's a good number. Let's hope it keeps going up today, because we definitely need more people. 75 average, after all, is what we're aiming for. So, again, feel free to invite your friends. Come on by whenever you can, even if it's just to lurk. It really does help out. We also have a pretty cool Discord community, if you want to check that out. I have a coffee link if you want to help directly monetize my content. And I got a merch store if you want to buy some cool stuff. All links are in the description, so check them out at your leisure. Let's go ahead and start a new game and figure out how the hell this co-op stuff exactly works. I assume we can do it right off the bat because we do get four characters, I recall from the demo, right off the bat. So this co-op function should be functional. Let's let's see how it works. But first story. Seventeen seventy-seven, the Irish coast. A Royal Navy flagship sails from the Caribbean back to Great Britain. Full of evil pirates and prisoners to be judged. Is it Caribbean or Caribbean? I've never I've heard people say it both ways. Same. I'm not entirely sure. Caribbean sounds better, but I don't know. Yeah, the, I think Caribbean sounds better. Eh. The pirate rich Flora Burn casts a spell using an ancient amulet that transforms everyone on board. Honestly, with a name like that, she should have just burned the ship down, but <laughs> I assume she has a fire magic. Now, there's one thing I remember for the demo. The character dialogue was kind of... Eh, it was fine. Flora Byrne kidnaps the Admiral's son and escapes through a pirate crew. The setting seems pretty good, but if I recall correctly, I wasn't super into the dialogue. So, I won't probably read it all out. Though I think a lot of it is voice anyways. Dill struck! The Admiral brought us and remain prisoners of freedom in exchange of us rescue his son. Those are, the, those are our playable characters, of course. <laughs> Ever since Dark Souls did it, do it, did it, it's really cool to have a downtrodden character in an unfortunate position of being your main character. But I guess that's a trope only older than Dark Souls. Much older. Can you hear the... Good. Benjamin Blacksmith is such a name. <laughs> No shit, Sherlock. We're turning to rats? I didn't notice. I don't know, man. If you can turn into rats, if you can solve that whole situation, I think I'd be like, ah, fuck this. I don't care about the pirates anymore. It's pretty quiet still. Really? Is it quiet for you guys? Let me know as a whole. Ah, oh, yeah, it does seem a bit quiet. It's one of those games where the audio balancing is all over the place for different stuff. Oh, but you know what? The volume controls, they may have finally properly adjusted, so now it's adjusted that really low number I set it to. So maybe they finally <laughs> caught up, and that's why it's so quiet. I'll adjust it after the cutscene. Well, 
Does that rule apply when the ship is capsized on land, though? You shouldn't say that, and then he just then there's mutiny. <laughs> mutiny. Alright, so confirm join disconnect all. Uh let's both hit join. There we go. I'm P one. Ooh. I'm P two. If I recall, Buffalo Calf is the it, remember how in the demo we found out one of them was just better? Dave Douglas is a swashbuckler. Buffalo Calf is the one with range, I think. I believe so. And then Bussa is just big and burly and punches stuff, I think. And Akane is also fast, but without range. I can't remember, actually. I legitimately can't remember who is ranged here. David was definitely the, here's your standard, like, slashy boy. Vanilla. <laughs> kind of, uh, chal uh, like, skill level. I think it was Buffalo Calf that, uh was the one that I found to be, like, really good. But I can't remember. It's either her or Akane. I can't remember which one. We can switch, though. We can we can change it afterwards, so... I can just test and find out. I think part of the reason she was so good was... Whichever one it was, was because... She got an ability. Well, she does have range, because the the slashy slash. The stabby... You know. What is this called? What is this? What is this spear? Thank you. Kind of a spear, anyway. Oh, what? It's a glaive. You've caused me to teleport. I think you're you're hitting continue now. Oh, okay. You talked to him. Oh, I did. You did. That's why your character is there. <laughs> well, you talked to him or walked past him, one or the other. Let me. Uh, let's play with the audio a bit. All right, stream goers. I'm gonna turn off this for a second, just for a second. Stream goers. Volume check. Tell me what you think. It's definitely a lot louder now. Loud. Is it though? Because you guys are kind of confusing me a little bit. Better. Loud and better. See, this is why it's so hard to adjust audio sometimes. <laughs> you don't have me in the Listen chat up, to give the best Please answer. <laughs> why do people keep talking to me? I don't know. You talk oh, to him. Oh, it's. You talk is to it him. Up? Yes! That's. The oh, okay. <laughs> like, that's why there's an. I guess it's not really an arrow, to be fair. I'm trying my best. It's okay, Fox. Like, um, I want to know, is the audio quieter than me? By a reasonable amount that doesn't make it muted. That's really the question we're asking when I'm asking if the audio is good. Is it quieter than me, but still audible? If the answer to that is yes, then it's where it should be. Okay. Then let's turn this back on for... Just tell me again, Astler, when it's good for you. Now we have to, like, readjust. Try jumping while you do it, because the, uh, the noises. You don't make a noise, huh? That's more than enough. There, then? I can't tell easily, because I'm wearing a head headset. <laughs> That's fine. Okay. As long as it's not coming through double. That's the goal. <laughs> all right, let's uh, so we can talk to all these people. Well, what do you expect from a rat like Flora? Literally, taking advantage of the chaos like that, and taking little Timmy with her too. This guy has Beerus's accent. <laughs> Holt, no one's allowed in right now on account of the repairs. What we're doing, Captain's orders. <laughs> Except for Beerus is cuter. So, I mean, let's... Uh, how, how do you change characters? I don't remember. So, here's the other thing. On the on this menu, we can also hit... No, not that. Hut. Okay. How do you do it? There is, like, an upgrade tree. I guess we have to unlock it, technically. Hurry. Rest if you need anything... Yeah, I don't honestly. Hold on a second. I'm getting annoyed about something because I cannot remember it and it's annoying me. Hold on just a moment, guys. All I need is a second of my old video. And I'll remember which character I was like. Yeah, that's the one.
All right. By the way, if you're curious, I played this game... Yeah, I've spent two and a half hours just doing the whole demo. That was nine months ago. Which character was I played? Yeah, see? It was her. Uh. So it is Akane, who is the one that I was like, yes, this is the one for me. I believe part of it was not just her basic movements and abilities, but also some of her upgrades, which were like, yes, this is just a superior upgrade tree. Look how beers. My voice is not cute, it sucks. <laughs> oh yeah, I put it over there so you can read it too. There's all sorts of people. And boxes we can push for some reason. Alright, let me reposition it in a second. There we go. Ledge guard. You are? Wait, does that actually ledge guard? No, it doesn't. Okay, that's good to know. Might be important to know now and then. Also, I believe it's set. Like, go forward. Just advance. Yeah, it's entirely locked. Oh, you can go off screen, oh. though. <laughs> Fair enough. Whose idea was it to let Johnson because they are for Britain. Why are the guards British? Because they are for Britain. <laughs> yeah, there you go. That kind of solves the question. The spiciness would at least what I wouldn't give for a bit of spice. Obviously, side quest. That's that's evil. Hit it. Cool. Did we both get an apple, or did I just take one? Do you have an apple? Okay, I guess we share items. All right. Blacksmith, that is the blacksmith. I ain't here at the moment. Come back later. That's right. We have to like find him. I vaguely remember some of the story, uh, some of the beginning. To the death with spoon. Spears. He might have been admiral. Without the air, the hat just wouldn't stay. I think it's slang for something. Not about that. Do listen here, recruit. Do you want to hear Major Mallory's martial lesson? Do you want to hear the martial lessons? He almost alliterated of that. Why did they mess that up? <laughs> no, I'm just thinking about what what's a word for lessons that starts with M. I don't care about the lesson. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Martial musings? I don't know. Yeah. It's not really like teaching. Why do so many games have treasure chests with locks on them that don't actually matter? Oh, I guess I make you warp if we change areas. Okay, fair enough. Mastery? Mystery? Masteries? Maybe. Memos? Hmm. Memoirs? <laughs> Would you like to buy something? Ah, now wait the long faces. We lost a lot of our cargo with provisions in the ship. Everybody's getting on really fine for just being turned into rats, though, in this, aren't they? Like, they're just like, oh, okay, well, I guess we'll just work with that. Commercial agreement. To be sure. Would you like to buy something? Especially after it just caused them to also crash the ship. Yeah. Probably lost people in that. Okay, the only thing we want are the wobbly lamp and the wool. We want to skip everything uh, else. We don't want to support the wool industry. But we have to. Mm -hmm. Just for saying that, we're immediately buying this. No! Whatever animal produced this couldn't have had long to live. No! <laughs> <laughs> the lamp is a thousand. I didn't have enough. <laughs> but I'll start with wool. I'm pretty sure those are all quest stuff, so. I need the wool for something or other. Let's go this way. Do we have a. I don't know if we actually have a map. <laughs> More money. Punch those pots. Yeah. 
Wait a minute. So I just have control over where we're going. Yep. Wondering if As it should be. Thought so. Yeah, it just pops up here. Right here. That's, our, that's an enemy. Kill it. Not anymore. Are you okay, Fox? He just did a, you know, he was doing a, he was doing a Careful reference. Flora and her gang of wrongans are making an army of monsters out. I want to hear, I want to hear Beerus say wrongans. <laughs> Take that, pot. I just realized this guy is totally just... Hellish crap. Always cheating. I'm sure he's got an ace up his sleeve. Or, you know, in the claw. If only I had a gosh darn ace of spades, I could beat him. All right, he is a quest guy. I thought so. Bad what are you looking at? You're making me nervous. I can't play poker like that. So, so is he in the middle of a round of poker and asking you, like, verbally to go get him another card? Like a specific so card so he could cheat. In this particular round that he is still playing. Again, people are getting on so well with the whole, like, I turned into a rap. They're like, well, we can communicate with crabs now. Let's play poker with them. Okay, that guy just doesn't want to fight back, apparently. <laughs> what was that about? I remember there's an upper root and a lower root. We should do, loop uh, back for it. I was gonna punch it. that lamp. Wait, what's going on? Cutscene. That's what. Mm -hmm. Stop. Who are you, ghost? I am not a ghost. Mind your manners. I am Wu Yun, emissary of the Shen of the Southern Sea, and I've been itching to get out of the amulet. So you are the magical entity inside the amulet. Why haven't you appeared until now? <laughs> what did it take you like five minutes of gameplay to show up? Jeez, you took forever. Far beyond your capacity for understanding. I will attempt to explain, however. The eye of the serpent has passed hand to hand around the world for centuries. It's always the amulet. Showed our favor to the master of the Eye of the Serpent, and ever have we charged a fair price for it. Some have attempted to destroy it, but the Eye of the Serpent remains to observe the world. In its recent history, Flora Bird stole the Eye of the Serpent in the Caribbean. Flora is now beginning to grasp the power she has in her hands, and her abilities grow by the hour. She has a slight Carmen San Diego vibe going on. It's a really weird way to say say thing. That's a really weird line to say right in response to a cutscene. But okay. But Flora boarded our ship and stole it from us. So she was related to it, but that I am is the same for every character, yes. Enough. We have no time for further talk. Every minute is precious. Flora Byrne has the ring. The other half of the eye of the serpent. Which was separated when the powerful spell was cast. I am owed a debt for my service to her. I will take payment. Meanwhile, I'm just My standing here watching this. Without the ring. But I can feel ancient and powerful. Harvest all the spiritual energy you can, and I will help you recover your Perhaps I can make you human again. It is my duty to bring the eye of the serpent to the shogun. And that's what I'll do. I will retrieve the ring at any cost. The amulet will be reunited. I will not fail. Perfect. Occasionally her voice actor sounds French rather than what she's going for. It's very odd. I will awaken your inner element. Why do they want to turn back? Because in any TF story, you don't want to be the thing you're turned into. I'm gonna go back to Cuba. That's where everybody is. That's how I'm everybody talking feels. to ghosts. Can I help you? Yeah, we can change characters here. That's right. And the skill system, I recall. I don't recall what. 
There was something in particular I was like, oh yeah, wait, actually, wait, wait, was it this? this? Oh yeah, the Y skill, that's right. Um, they're just laying down her tree that was like really ridiculous in the demo. I'm gonna see if it's still there. I think it was that. Haha, <laughs> they still didn't fix that. I think that mistake was there before. Do you see it? What? Exactly. Oh. <laughs> well, there's a water slash. A water slash? Yeah, I'm wondering that myself. <laughs> Yeah, I think the water slash in particular was the, the thing. It was just have a ranged attack for free, basically. If I recall correctly, that was the reason I used her. And I think on the side here, I think this is all like spell stuff, so it costs mana. But then again, some of this doesn't. But yeah, if you want to focus magic, go down this way. Okay. So I'll, go, I'll just go down this tree. Uh, when I can. <laughs> you can look for yourself, too. Let's see. Actually, we probably do all have different elements. Yeah, you're, you're Earth. That makes sense. The forgotten element, water. <laughs> Spend a win. They use the Pokemon with Sonic Boom. They do, though it's different. I don't think it's as useful here. Actually, no, Sonic Boom was kind of useless in Pokemon unless you got it really early. So what, on the left, as far as like non-magical stuff, lethal damage for size, you with one HP. That's not bad. Oh, it's fine. It helps, uh, it block. You can heal yourself 100 HP by doing okay, what? definitely not touching this side because I'm terrible at blocking. Are you sure? Have you tested it yet in this game? Uh, in general, I just never use block buttons. I noticed we have the same spirit energy. I wonder if we're spinning from the same pool. Oh yeah, we have... And that's mine. Just... Oh, that's another reason. She can, she can sequence break. With her thing. Oh, sorry. Oh. We'll, we'll go back around. I want to go up and left. If I recall, it's just a big loop in this area, so... Watch out. That guy's, that guy's no. mean. So I know we're, we're getting the same spiritual energy, but I do wonder if we literally use the same pool, or... No, we have... Uh, it's, up, like it's on the top. You can see it. Okay. Over here, though. Okay. Also, we leveled. That's, that is a system, too. There is leveling. Oh, so there's a... You healed me. You're welcome. Ice I'm just gonna take credit for that. <laughs> I'm just gonna accept it. Sure. Oh, yeah, this is a door. Oh, shit. Um, do we want to lock those? We kind of probably do. Do we? It's like I, right next to the base. That's why we want it. Think of it from far away, get a key item, oh, we can yeah. turn it in. Because we don't have one that's already there. It's kind of mean to. I, I, I like games that have fast travel, especially Metro Vegas, but it's, it's always like, aww, when it, they. I always feel a little disappointed when it's like, oh, but you have to unlock it. For like, some money. <laughs> Hell, too aggressive there. <laughs> go up and right because I you say as if you're giving me a choice <laughs> if you want to if Lewis yeah there's a guy here I'm surprised Beerus had the self-restraint not to comment on the poker guy, player's pause by the way yeah that's alliteration <laughs> so there's a decent I don't know how good this game is it depends on how much it feels pretty much the same as the demo right now like the controls I thought that myself Maybe you have, what are your thoughts of the controls right now? Do you think they're like a little basic, a little stiff? They're a little bit stiff. They're a little stiff. Like it's not bad. You can't move forward while attacking. Yeah, you're just kind of stuck on the spot, which is why I like her extra range. So yeah, it feels pretty much like the demo right now, which doesn't mean it's bad, but it does mean it doesn't feel any. It doesn't feel like this. At least this part of the game has been improved any. Which way? I'll chip it. 
Let's go down. Okay, because I think we want to go over. Oh yeah, down is correct. Hold down. There you go. Apple. Now we could use these items, but I suggest we just hoard them. It's weird that the, the slide doesn't have you hold forward at all. Fair enough, Beerus. <laughs> Oh, there's a drop down. You want to do the drop down? You want to keep going? Oh shit! Oh my oh, god! Punch I just remembered those guys are fucking all over the place. All right, which way do we go? I'm going here. Oh, you can change areas for oh. me. Okay, so we do. We both have the option. Punch crab. You send the worst possible place to fight that thing. Don't care. Well, with that, whatever. It doesn't matter. You level this. <laughs> Money. When we get a thousand, we can get a lamp, and we should because we go more down there. But let's check the screen first. Wait, can I, uh... No, I cannot. Oh, nice. sandwich. And we keep going this way, but let's not. So let's go oh, see what I have a body is. slam. Yeah, I have a down stab. <laughs> also, that seagull in the background is fucking ridiculous looking. Skelly. Skelly with the weird hitbox. <laughs> we just game. Actually, if we just just gang up on it, it, it gets stunned. So, there's a cup of tea. Did somebody ask for a cup of tea? I don't remember. No, it's just healing. <laughs> I wanted to check if it was a, what item type it was. So yeah, right now the demo I played nine months ago feels identical to what this is. So it doesn't feel like they really polished the controls or anything, which I was kind of hoping they would. It's not the end of the world that they didn't, but it was something I was curious about. Nice. <laughs> no. I do have enough. Give me the ring and the child, Flora Bun. Don't make me hurt you like the last time. No to the Esla. <laughs> Take care of the child, yes. Are you really the best blacksmith they could find to come after me? This is like evil Carmen San Diego, and I'm aware Sam Carmen San Diego was a villain, but she was like she was like charismatic, so she wasn't she was weird. <laughs> I don't know if I would call her evil as much as just She'd like to have a competition. Chaotic neutral. So she's definitely a villain. That guy. Well, well. Look what we've got here. A little rat looking for trouble. I if I recall the animated TV show, Carmen said you could actually say the main predicament that they got into like peril because that wasn't what she was about. She wasn't like wanting to get in, like in danger. She's still setting herself up to be the antagonist. Like that, that is villain behavior. Well, yeah, but she was doing it more because she wanted a game, not because she wanted to win. Do not stand in my way. Why don't you back off so I don't have to beat you? Up? You forgot up. <laughs> I'm gonna hit you so hard, your ears will dead. I'm taking this in a villain or two separate things. That's true. Yeah, that's true, but like when you're Watch when out. it's your goal to be the antagonist. I wonder if we could just damage DPS this guy. Maybe. <laughs> like it just occurred to me. We probably at least to some degree could. Actually, you might want to actually. I'm dying. You're dying. Whoops. I'm dead. What happens if one of us dies? Oh, live for seven seconds, please. Okay. Uh, okay. Interesting. Really? My turn to live for seven seconds. Ah, I didn't do it. <laughs> yeah, the controls are a little. So did we lose? Did we lose stuff? Did we like lose spirit energy? Let's see. Did we? Uh, maybe a little bit. Maybe a little bit. Check yours, actually. I want to see something. 
Okay, there's not really any way to check whether we Okay, have so same. we have the same amount. So me buying that dimensional door may have cost us both. Or we share. Or it is shared. See you later, Epic. I think we did lose some because if that if that enemy's even fifty. We have enough to get a thing. And then we can definitely check if they're the same. We take that top path too. Do I go back and just spin something? Alright. Yeah. Just to experiment. I mean, there's only one pull in the lower right. Rude. It is shared. Rude. I guess they did that for balance? I mean, I guess if there's two characters on the field, maybe them leveling up slower is fine. We can beat dudes up to get their money twice as fast. Yeah, I'm like thinking about that. Like, I guess that's okay. This means we have to, like, work together on balancing that out. Let's go this way this time. Time to jump. No. I think just down is just where we were. Uh, oh, okay. How does it show off here? Where, where's our... Oh, it's in the treasure bank, right? Who needs that? <laughs> oh, that's... That's He-Man. I'm not sure where I dropped this. <laughs> Let's try it again then. So yeah, we just have one spirit pool. See, there's our energy too. I'll let you walk for me. That was right. So oh, I got I got back 700. So I think that was everything we dropped, probably. I'll just block for me. How's that sound? I'm very good at dying. I would recommend now. Oh. I was blocking. <laughs> Were you blocking him directly? Yeah. Actually, wait, go ahead and buy something. There's enough. Even after losing some. So the losing system is just you gotta go pick up what you dropped, which is just standard Dark Souls, really. Can't go that low. <laughs> you have to start with Yeah, no, but I'm just checking where this leads to on the, the shallow end. Oh, well. I thought you checked earlier. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, I looked at, like, the, the big upgrades. Oh, you're going actually going to go... Magic. You're going down magic. magic? Yeah. Okay. So I think you recover magic by attacking things or something. Yep. That The jewel at the top. And we can get more jewels. Okay, you're going to go down magic. Okay, sure. Oh, this increases my defense, too. Oh, God damn it. It's good for that enemy, too, because while one of us gets blown up, the other one can just jump in and attack them. I love how those just break straight down. <laughs> uh, really, I think down is a path that has worse experience. I think this path gives us more experience because it's crap. This one's a better experience. Which <laughs> direction was he attacking? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that is worth more to us. I'm not sure, actually. Maybe not, I don't oh, know. Oh, I didn't get to break the pot. They don't have anything in them, do they? Okay, I'm gonna try not dying this time. I would recommend that. <laughs> I don't like his charge, because I can't block that. I can block that uh, if I'm not, like, trying to jump over it for some reason. Oh, you see, you can turn us into with the, uh, the, the, the attack to just... That... You just need to hit, like, attack or something. You can come back if you, like, go to me or something. I, I don't remember how it works. You know, you have to, like, go to me, though. There. Oh, okay. You have oh, to attack me. Oh, okay. That's good to know. 
All right. You did it. Like, his attack animation is fat. Yeah, by the way, if he doesn't hit you, look. He just gets stunned, so. I remember there was a trick gun. Oh, God. My, my goal is survivability right now. Sorry? It seems like a recommendable goal. The oh, way this has been going. Damn it. I probably could jump both those barrels, to be fair. Your it's a lot easier if I'm there to be able to block it. This game has corrosive touch going on? What does that mean exactly? Hey, level. That could be useful a little bit ago, I guess, but oh well. Yeah, going into the boss with full health would be... Contact awful. damage. Yeah, I feel like contact damage is... The way Fatso moves, I think without contact damage he'd be more reasonable to fight. So I feel like his attacks do enough damage without contact damage being a thing. But you gotta watch contact damage of all enemies, not just not just the boss, as that enemy just demonstrated that we actually have to drop that, right? Yeah. I actually have more trouble with yeah, some... Yeah, I don't understand why this game in particular has contact damage. I actually have trouble with some bosses more when I'm playing co-op, by the way, because it's harder to predict where the enemy's doing things. If we're on both sides of the enemy, watch, we'll get ready to dodge. Remember, if we can both jump this, he gets stunned. Then we can just rail on him. I can just jump both. Okay, I think I have to actually carry the attack. There have definitely been times where I could block the barrel completely, I think. You think you being dead means you don't get experience for fights? You only won because I haven't had my morning coffee. I was trying to revive you, but you didn't form very quickly. <laughs> you didn't try very hard. Yeah. You didn't float over to me. It's not your life all alone. I was floating over as fast as the left can take me. There, check your experience. Then. Uh, how? Um, it's a good question, actually. <laughs> uh, see when you level up. Yeah, I agree. The contact damage plus the characters have different range means. That's why I ended up liking her, because she has more range. Oh, hi. Why can't I hit that one? Also, it's one of those games where, hey, you killed an enemy. Sorry, some of the souls flew off into the abyss. I mean, you can kind of collect them quickly, but... You can see what I mean, though. Like, we have to actually splatter our way. Watch out. <laughs> I saw the barrel. I moving. I knew the... I immediately knew the barrel was a problem. Not because I played them, I just was like, that looks dangerous. I live. I like how Esler picked the brawler character and then was immediately like, I'm going down the magic path. Because that's what you do with brawler characters, yeah. right? To be fair, they each have their own tailored magic, so I'm sure it works fine. I help you. Did you I like picking brawlers because they're the like high damage Oh. That was another reason she was good. I forgot about that. Ah. So I guess we'll just one, 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 just each of us pick one and then go to the other person. Does that sound fair? Uh, I think we should go to like break points and then switch. Okay, well I'm going down this path and we'll just go yeah, in. So like go to the end of that path and then see how far I can get. Do I have to like completely back out for you to do it? And then I have to walk all the way over. It's great, isn't it? No, I actually wonder if we could shortcut like, that. This would be the next break point. Wait, what do you could Oh, because there's oh, no Oh I love it. <laughs> Somebody's happy. You just gonna you just gonna skip those? Yeah. Okay, yeah, you do actually have to. Interesting. I should check my magic path. I didn't realize magic abilities reduce the defense. Oh, okay. Five energy per second. 
Matt Warshill, that's an ability. Warshill, now this is. Yeah, my, my path isn't as interesting. Yours, your magic path has an interesting passive on it. I mean, I have some stuff I can get on the magic path, like print damage, but. Focus. Focus on coming in. I guess that's an ability? How do I get that? Breakpoints might not work as well since you have two of those there. I was going to say, like, you going by breakpoints, like, we'll yeah. go by breakpoints. And I'm like, we have completely uh, yeah, different they're, arrangements. They're not, like, the same arrangement. So, like, sure, like, whatever, really man. Work. But I don't. I wonder how this works exactly. It looks, sounds like a buff, but how do I use it? Okay. I mean, we'd like to know that beforehand, but all right. L and B. I'm just going to... There. Let me just... Ah, oh, that uses my magic, too. Okay, fair enough. Punch you wizard? Can. Yes. <laughs> Ooh, that one's too expensive. Actually, hold on a second. Sorry, I just like to have that up so I know what's going on. Critical damage is the worst. I cast fist. This response just made my day. Very good. <laughs> That is the same amount of money. You're going all. It. Okay, cool. I guess we're out now. Now I have two yeah. orbs. Ah. <coughs> I guess I'd benefit from that later too, with the whole focus thing. But also, I had to grab focus. Wasn't it in the in the way as well. And I deal more damage when I get myself killed immediately, and then you revive me. <laughs> What's this way? A lady. Oh wait, this is where we came from, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Oh well. Whatever. Those uh, pinchmen drop a fair amount of experience, so whatever. I just kind of figured you knew what you were doing. No, I mean I was getting <laughs> experience, I guess. Your soul energy. Or that. Right. Oh wait. <laughs> okay, wait, wait let me gone. check something. By the way, I want to check my damage. So just the next enemy, just ignore it for a second. Yeah, that crap. I'm gonna. Test how oh. high my aerial oh, damage that, is. That was weird. I was holding left that whole time when I ran all the way over there. 37. 47. Yeah, that's a difference. It's like 10 or 7 more damage, depending. Let's go this way first. Actually, maybe we should oh, just. That bounces me. Here's the thing, though. I don't think this Metrovania has a map. It looks unmistaken, so. At least not now. Oh, how'd you do that? Uh, left bumper. Oh. I mean, <laughs> you can see where we've been and where we haven't been. <laughs> Ow! Sorry. Rude! Why me? Because it's jumping. Oh, okay, so it bounces me and it forces me to go forward. I was wondering what the hell you were doing. It's like, we're not playing Mario, you can't do the stomp. Well, like, well, not that way you can't. That's what you think. Don't drop yet. We'll check that in a minute. Yeah, here we go. Yeah. Okay. I can tell you exactly where the demo cuts off. Vaguely remember, anyways. What was your plan there? Uh, I was gonna body slam the crab, but then it was dead, and then it exploded. Actually, we did change areas. You wanna go back? Ah, uh, up to you. Sure. Okay. There's stuff. Backtracking is fine. Stuff. Is what a good. nice chest! Giving you two hundred money you just spent back. I, I mean, wait, did we just spend some money? Yeah, the, on the door. Oh, that's true. Actually, that's a good point. Ah, see, it literally went this way because it was required. Alright, you wanna. I am noticing that. Yeah, if we. By the way, the bosses. Let's try to stay on both sides of the boss because I think that kind of shuts it. Oh, that. You, you immediately jumped. jumped out. This place has a lot of spikes, I recall. Let's go. Whee! Watch out, it's a dangerous digger. <laughs> He's gonna angrily and dangerously dig. If I recall, yeah, push that, push it down. Actually, I can't. Okay. I don't know why there's so many pushing the blocks the wall. when they're against the wall. Yeah. If I recall, this area is harsh but not very big. Oh, behind. Gotta get behind. 
Don't worry, I got my damage buff after. Ow! <laughs> Wait, I don't no, actually. Even from behind, it doesn't do anything. Try your magic. Uh, I can't. I'm dead. That's oh, move. you can pogo effectively. Ah. <laughs> nope, nothing. Huh? They are immortal. <laughs> That's right. That bat. I think there's a way to kill them. I don't remember how. Stay out. For the moment, at least. This is definitely a later area, so to speak. Clam. <laughs> I was in the process of winding up an attack, but it was too slow. Oh, hold on. Actually, I think this is a. God, this camera angle for this jump. Alright. I want to say this leads to treasure. Oh, at least a bat. Bats are kind of treasure. <laughs> Still think that as it kills you? Yes. Yeah, there is treasure, I was right. Apple. An apple. The greatest treasure of all. Plant. Try to clear the screen before we. Oh, hello. Oh, that's right. Oh, you're not an enemy. Rick is sick. Bats are the sheep of the sky. <laughs> ba? What? So he, that's what it car said. What? How so? And receive instructions from a bitter admiral. Or I want to be free. Man, all these British people are boring. Oh right, this guy wants. I want to be. Why are you looking at me like that? I know I don't look much like a corsair. But with the this is the guy that the wig is for. This guy wants a disguise. Long beard, cook, pirate clothing, cloth padding. Give me a hand here. If you help me, I'll be in He did not ask for a wig. Well, you help me get. I just need to get long beard. So I think we can take the wig and turn it into a beard of the tailor or something, if I recall. Also, as to why this guy is fucking here of all places, I have no idea. How did he get here? Fell. I mean, we fell in too, if you recall. There's a point of no return, unless we die. Uh. Yeah, so it works, I guess. Or does it? <laughs> Wait, can we not go up there then? Huh. Hold on a second. Let me just. Let me. Wait! Come over here. Die. Oh, oh! But I think it just pulls me to you when you hit me. Not if I am in the right spot. Hover above this platform. Yeah, I know what you're thinking. Yeah, it just pulls me to you. Did you try holding left as I was doing that? It just pulls me. Okay, alright. This co op sequence breaking is entirely a thing in some games. Alright, so, uh, there's a down here and a down to the left. <laughs> Your pick. Okay. I did it. Let's go left now. See if it matches, meets up or not. Ah! Oops. I missed, I missed click. <laughs> no cheese in a rat game? Good point. <laughs> I'm sure I'll find cheese. I think I found some cheese in the demo. Okay, we don't have a whole lot here, so I, I can only really buy one thing at the moment. And my next thing is a thousand two hundred. Okay. Oh, there's a. Okay. <laughs> it's a little hard to tell the transition screens, isn't it? Actually, I think that I want to say. Oh fuck. Oh. I want to say this dead ends over here. Actually, if I recall. With a treasure. Is it true though? Or do you just want to say it? I just like. No, I cannot repeatedly okay, pelt yeah, it. You can't do another one after it's, you've you. You can't it. immediately do it again. I was what do you think is in these eggs? Oh. Apple. I keep wanting to hit select to see the map. I think another game had select as the map, so I'm just used Good to it. Question. What is in those? 
right? It's hard to tell. I actually don't really know why I was waiting for you. Could have probably Same. blindly jumped up there. It was off screen, to be fair. There's a way to kill these guys. I don't remember how. Watch out, that. Oh, okay. I meant it. <laughs> Wow. Bats are fucking... Oh, right, there's spikes there. <laughs> <laughs> they blend in okay! Let's go pick that back up. Where were we? Oh, yeah. Oh, it tells you. Okay, that's nice. I'm sorry, it's the same color... Oh, as ever. See? <laughs> it's, it's not just me! Oh, we can't go that way, so let's go down. What way can we go? Right, there's a right. Alright, well. Hmm. Ow. <gasps> the door is locked. Ow. Hmm. I was attempting to try the No 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 roll. What if I trigger you at Ooh, the same time? Actually. I yeah. I have an idea. Yeah? What if I go up here? Oh, no. I can't do a roll there. So it's a drop through. Oh, platform. but there's... Oh, did you see that? Was, that was very close. Unless I can... No, you can't do it in the air. Go over by the ledge. There was a brief moment where I was standing on it. I think it might... Oh, oh, Listen, if I jump just right, I was standing on the ledge for a brief second before I died. If oh. if I trigger you that time, it'll probably spot you there. Oh. <laughs> Not if you hit the top spikes. I didn't even know I could do that. Actually... Oh, no! It just pulls me back into the spikes. Well, then. <laughs> Alright, never mind, then. They don't want us to cheese this. <laughs> <laughs> I had a feeling that was going to happen, but I have to be careful. Actually, wait, I'll just hang back. It seems safer. I'll get him next time. There we go. You did. Yeah, I actually timed it that time instead of... Oh, no! Or wait. I can't. She <laughs> spikes that way. <laughs> I was literally standing in the same spot, man. Oh. <laughs> the double. Yeah. Uh, you want to throw yourself into the spikes to get more help? Oh. oh. <laughs> You'll tell me that before <laughs> I start jumping. <laughs> Just go to the next screen. The timer keeps going. Yeah, fair enough. But there might be enemies. There like is. This bat. Hit me. Oh, that was close. Sable's got you. Watch out for the spikes there. So, th I oh, remember spikes. this area annoyed me, though, because they're hard to see, aren't they? They're just... It'd be nice if they chose a different color scheme. I remember saying that in the previous, uh, in the demo. I was like, it's man, especially, especially with all the foreground stuff obscuring here and there, it makes it a little harder. Because you're constantly getting fooled by all these little spikes. Things. You're constantly getting fooled by all the foreground details. No. You're constantly getting fooled by the foreground details, so it's really kind of unreasonable. Right, <laughs> wall jumping is a thing, though. Maybe. No? Only on the designated wall jump walls. Also, how do we get out of here? Huh, maybe we can climb out and I didn't... I thought it was a drop, straight drop down, but maybe not. Alright. Very good. All according to plan. Level up. Did you level? You did level. Uh, yes, I did. Alright. The pushable blocks were to help you get back up. Oh, were they? Because they were stuck against they the were wall. Stuck against the wall. Yeah, we couldn't really move them. Let's try. Is this even the right way? So green rooms yes. are level up rooms and blue rooms are teleport rooms. Yeah, also yes. Oh. Right. <laughs> oh, time. but the level up healed me, but it didn't heal because you're you're in spirit form, so you didn't yeah, get a full heal dead. out of it. Let me just go back up. Let's try. Well, okay, the boxes are there to help us kind jump of. back up. He's he's right about kind that. Of. 
I like how the, I love this enemy though. I mentioned him in the demo. I love him because he's like wall jump balls. Yeah, wall jump balls. I love that guy though because he's like, haha, I'm what? going to dig. Oh, okay. that's good to know. I was like noticing that countdown. But yeah, I love that guy. He's like, ha, I'm gonna dig at you. Watch weird. out, dirt. <laughs> like I jumped up and then I flew back to the left. That guy is really good at defeating germaphobes, I imagine. <laughs> We have enough to buy the lamp. You want to go back? Actually, yeah, that's smart. Let's go up here. Why do we want to buy a lamp? Let's clear this screen, actually. Oh, oh that guy just wants the PC, apparently. Several of them, probably. And he did have, in fact, a piece of you. Several of them, in fact. Wait a minute. Okay, I did open the map, right? No, we go back, we buy the lamp to make Beerus happy no. so he keeps watching the stream. No. Well, you just float around as a ghost. <laughs> Wait, if I don't... You can't even interact with anybody like this, I don't think. <laughs> You're just gonna leave me like this. For the moment. Now, can I get there? No! I'm so slow as a ghost! <laughs> me too. Everybody thinks I'm just because I'm fat, but that is also true. <laughs> Lamb shots to be had tonight. <laughs> Meanwhile, you're just haunting the shop area. Wobbly no! lamp! No! I'm sorry, you would have preferred me to buy the premium ball of wool, I guess? No. So you're, you're at a loss here regardless, then. You realize this, right? Mm -hmm. well, you wouldn't have had enough for that. I actually didn't have enough, you're right. Alright, let's go back where we were and... Well, there's two paths. Let's take, the, let's take that one. Nobody on stream knows which one I pointed out. <laughs> just you. Just Neither you. do I. <laughs> wait, what? Wait, hold on. The tailor. Where's the tailor? Oh god, that's right. You having to find the NPCs. We need the tailor real fast, actually. I almost tried to see if I could body slam the, the tentacle. Oh, hey, what's an ace of spades? Just Poker Sailor. That's all he's known as. I don't remember where everybody is. There's a tailor guy somewhere. Oh, he had a treasure. Good thing I talked to him again. Very good. <laughs> I did not press off. You did. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> I just like breaking things. It accomplishes exactly nothing. This guy wants pepper. Where's the, where's the guy that was sewing clothes? I was trying to remember. There's an X here. There is an X there. Go steal that sho shovel guy. There he is. Okay, I guess not. I thought he. I thought he did something with the wig. Never mind. I'm misremembering. Hurry. If you need it. There is a left. Way now? No one's allowed in right now. On no, we can't. That's like the ship, and it's probably like place with more shops and stuff. Yeah. To you. Oh, it is. <laughs> Whenever I play a game, co-op with somebody, and it's it's Digimon World 4, same experience, like, no, it's you advancing the Dalek prompt, it's your color, it's your thing, it's like, nobody ever notices it's them. <laughs> they always just think, they always just wait for me to do it. I press the jump button again instead of the attack button. So instead of body slamming, I just didn't. I noticed that. <laughs> Alright, we'll teleport back. 8 out of 10. Honestly, I'd give this a 7 out of 10 because they didn't improve the controls, which is a point to me. I was hoping for a little more refinement to the controls. It's not bad by any means, but you do feel it during the boss fight. Like, Fatty's harder than he should be because of the stiff jumping. <laughs> so fat this game is 8 out of 10. Oh, that's right! I forgot, you can just run. Which apparently also uh -huh. triggers you. Yeah, just try holding the down B. And just keep tapping it. Fire. Uh -huh. I think I, unfortunately, we no. don't have momentum 
It does. I want to murder. Okay. Yay. We get distracted, dang it. I mean, look at Essler. <laughs> I'm a very distractible person, but he takes the cake. Also, we can probably buy something now. Who else bought something? I was me, right? Uh, yeah. My thing costs 1200 though, which is twice as much as yours. Fine, buy it. I was thinking we should just go back and forth. That is, what is it? Oh, that's the spin to win. Down and Y. Down and Y. Ooh, it's try fast. Try and it only costs half. Try moving while doing it. No. Why not? It's too fast. Uh, okay. I'll try it here. I mean, if you do, want to. Do, do, do. Oh, I, okay. So I need a bar, but it only uses half. You can't use it? Like, literally can't, right? Oh, now you can. Yeah. Oh, yeah, now I can. But now I can't. So it uses half a bar, but requires a whole bar. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we'll buy oh, item. Buy money. I. Why do so many games do this? Why are so many games like. Same, so many game designers are like, oh, yeah, we'll have the enemy drops just fly everywhere. It's really fun. And it's like, it's never fun. <laughs> it's never a fun way of doing an item drop system. But so many games do it. And I don't know why. I guess because it's like more interesting to look at. It's like, oh, look, they're going everywhere. How dynamic. But it's just. It's dumb. Just give me the items. <laughs> But and even if I have, like, a nearly full bar car, I still can't do it. Yeah, he has to have actually a far full bar. It's like, right now, my bar is nearly full, but I yeah, can't Yeah, he do can't it. use it even at that little sliver. See that little sliver he doesn't have? Doesn't That's too little. Um, but yeah, I don't know why so... And then some games upcharge you, too. Some games are like, oh, well, items fly everywhere. What's going on? But you can get an magnet upgrade to fix this. Like, thanks, yeah. fix the problem that shouldn't exist. Oh, no. We're wet. Oh, hi. Oh, he's chanting. I, you get the bosses real fast. I don't remember this guy! He might have been added after the devil. Are they trying to go for, like, a... Uh, um, What's the doctor's name in Futurama? It kind of sounds like they're going for, like, his Zoyberg. nephew or something. Zoidberg's nephew voice. <laughs> it's Zoidberg's nephew, everyone. <laughs> this is what crabs sound like. Do you agree that this dialogue is, like, kind of whatever, though? There's, it feels like there's yeah. a lot of wordiness, but not a lot. I think I'm just kind of a little bit bothered or distracted by the setting. Because everybody's so casual about being turned around, so it just feels a little weird story wise, you know? Yeah. So I'm pretty sure this guy wasn't the demo. I mean, it's what oh, they I do. Can't. Can't do my spin. If he faces you, be, be more casual. Be more casual? I don't think I can do that. I, okay. Oh, okay. What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> okay, okay, what, what's he doing? <laughs> yeah, you notice how enemies just like, they just go, right? There's like no warning momentum. It's just like, oh, they're doing a the thing, okay. It's like, okay, there's, there's a long pause. It's clearly setting up for something. My god, could you fight in front of my attack? Thank you. Oh, did that apparently. Oh, he's stunned, okay. Oh, I don't have a. Uh... I don't have enough to spin. 69! Oh, okay. I was trying to spin, but sure. Yeah, I think it's just the fact that the enemies are just... There's no, there's no like, wind-up or choreography to their attacks. They just do it. They just do it, and it's not really a fun way of fighting a boss. Like, there's something to be said for animation frame. Like, for instance, Fatty, if he, if he was going to start running to you, it'd be great if he did, like, a little crouch and then, like, start running or something, you yeah. know? Or, like, if there was some kind of tell to know whether he's going to do the the body slam or the swing. Oh, we just ran. We one of those done. I can block, and the other I can't. Okay, we got... Yes, as you all know, finding a giant crab naturally unlocks the double jump. By the way, we should now, we should now officially backtrack to the caves if we want. Well, we don't have to. I was trying to reach the middle platform, I was curious. <laughs> Never mind. 
I'm just trying to be close enough to not immediately die. I mean, die. Fatty Hat tells with some of his attacks, but I feel like the developers are like, oh, this is a basic attack, this one doesn't need a tell, and I'm like, no, it probably still should have one. Like, the, the Philly developers are like, no, some attacks should have tells, but not all. Honestly, I feel like every enemy in every game should have a tell for every one of their attacks. It doesn't have to be a huge tell. Just a little something letting you know what they're doing. Plus, it just means more animation, more life to the character. It was extra weird for, like, the, the body slam that he had, because Fish. the swing does have a tell, and that one I could block easily. That's what I mean. That's why it's so confusing, because when some attacks have... Oh, okay. Fish, I, I said. <laughs> yeah, it was body slamming off of them. Oh, like that. Yeah. oh, well, I guess it is worth something. But yeah, like, it's actually more confusing when some attacks have tells and some don't. You can jump that. No, I can't. Double jump? Oh, yeah, double jump. He would literally exists. just earned that ability, and I just used it to get over there. How did you think I was there? No, I can't. Only you can reach that platform, because you're the master of jumping. Jill, the master of jumping, you know? It's just weird that we have a double jump now. From defeating a giant crab, because naturally that's the thing that unlocks Wait, the double jump. Why? Why do we? Just because. We were stuck in the area. We needed a double jump to leave. What, what is the, the lore reason for why we can jump twice Back now? Killers. Hey, Crimson, thanks for the tier 3 sub, my dude. Um, what, what causes it? Oops, I did the thing again, sorry. You did indeed. I did the thing that I shouldn't do. Why not defeating a pigeon or a sick? Yeah, if we fight like some bird that just wanted to eat us because we were a rat, that would have been better, actually. Then we gotta go double jump and be like, okay, fair enough. Um, Alright, I'll just get my defense up. I'm just thoroughly going down it. I don't think you can afford the thing you want to buy, or maybe you can. Probably not. But what is the next thing? To have buy? you not seen wild crabs double jump? I mean, no, I Almost. haven't. That would be very, yeah. that would be very impressive damage. if I saw that in our IRL. Is there anything? There's nothing important down there. I'd be, I would be very impressed if I saw a crab double jump in real life. Uh, so I basically can't do anything for the rest of like this run, probably. I need to get, get like both of the like 2,400 is what I need to get a meaningful upgrade. I see. Unless I wanted to buy like early no. stuff from the other path, but no, that's not. So this all is in, all the we're way. in the fisherman play. Oh, by the way, 11% down with the map, so you can get an idea of how much game there is here. We have cleared 11% at this time. You want to fight birds? There's a bird to no. fight. I do remember the chickens. They just explode or something. Um, let's go down to connect to the other path. Sure. Okay. Oh. The nooks into this far. Oh, the other path was up. Okay, well, you know, let's see. That's just fine. We can do more here anyways now. Um... They'll check the full room first. Let's clear the room out. Also, yeah, we're gonna have to come back or <laughs> spikes, by the way. <laughs> so we're gonna have to remember these and come back to, do to them. A body slam on that. Oh yeah, go down here. I remember this room. Secret oh. walls. Secret walls are okay. a thing. I just remembered, and because I remember this room. You know why I remember this room? Because it's a fucking Ow. room. Go spikes. Ahead. Go ahead. Ow, spikes. I guess I can safely try once. Okay. Try again. It's entirely possible, but motherfucker. I remember Spain a long time here. That's why I remember that was there. Yeah, oh, by the way, secret walls. Probably Could you tell that was a secret thing. wall? I don't think no. that wall was... Yeah, I don't but know how we're going to tell. another wall now that I've seen... The... Okay. Adjustable. This jump, jump looks easy enough, like if it was just the right timing, but it's actually. I do remember getting this chest though. Is, is there a way to jump less? Yeah, just look. Small jump, small jump, small jump. Big jump! Small jump, small jump, small jump. Slightly larger jump. It all depends on how you tap it. That was very close. I remember spending so much time on this in the demo. I think I do need to double jump. You do. It needs to be like a control jump and then a double jump. I remember you spending all that time. Yeah, you remember this too, right? 
the question is, how did I even find this secret room? It's not very obvious. I don't. I, th there's others too early. There's also others, other places, but I don't know where. Their swinging sounds like slow as heck laughter. Ha 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 ha! Oh, too early still. You can tell that this is doable. I spent so much time with this. It looks like they tried to make it impossible. Still too early. It's also hard to tell the hitbox because logically, like, the left side of the spike should be a little lower than the hitbox, but I don't know actually if it is. I think the hitboxes are wonky. Too late. Wouldn't it be great if we could just, like, to... walk carefully around them without jumping? Like, some games allow for that, like Valorant. Like Lana. Lana. I think Dying on the lower spike, like, you're getting jump height right for the first jump. It's just a matter of time that second jump. That second jump just needs to be the smallest little thing. Yeah. It does indeed need to be the smallest little thing. Why would we? Oh, left? that's why, Car, because it's like, yeah, why can't you go down that far? So there's probably other secret walls in this game. I don't know. I hope there's. Here's the thing about oh. secret walls if they're not very obvious and there's no tells on the map, which I don't think there was for this. You can see how the, if you look closely, you can see there's just a solid wall there. So there's like there's no tell on the map either. So I really hope there's an item later that lets helps you find secrets or something. Yeah, everybody's favorite Metroid item, the X-ray specs. Can I use my magic in the air? Uh, visor. Stay. Well, it depends on what button magic is, because I forgot. <laughs> it's why. I don't know then, maybe not. Is no, it doesn't appear that I can yeah, use I can't it use later. mine in the air. Hold on a second. Uh, neither of them. I might be able to hit that with my magic. But we need to open it, not hit it. Like, hit your ghost. Uh, okay, let me oh, try jump. Let me try you. my jump then. That was pretty close. I am smaller. I don't know if that matters. If you don't try hitting my ghost, then it would have to be about here. Oh, right. Yeah. Let me Good try shot. it. Let me let me take a few shots of this. Wait. Oh no, leaving the room won't help. I was curious if I can room transition us. Do you get magic for punching your ghost? I do! What, you get magic for punching Yeah, you get magic back for punching the ghost. I guess it is you because are you punching hit, something. I am, it's a hitbox, so I guess that makes sense. Only, wait, do you though? You just low, it just went down and up? I saw the meter literally go up and down. No, like I had one, exactly one orb, because I had used my big magic, and now I have more. I you notice how it's, you notice how it's pulsing you. up and down right now if you pay attention to it? See, it goes up. I definitely, I think this is totally, I remember, wait, if you don't die, do you just get teleport back? I can't remember. Hmm? If you don't die, do you get teleported back to the start, or do you just get stuck at the spike? If you die in the spikes, does it teleport you, if you get hurt on the spikes, does it teleport you back? That's what I'm asking. I think it does send you back. So I could just eat an apple and charge through, maybe, but I don't know if that's worth it. It's, it's been a while. Okay. That wasn't really. Ooh, that was close. You got it. You just were a little too early. The hitboxes are definitely not to the models. Like, I'm pretty sure it's a box. Magic again. I want to say it's a box. Right? Actually, you know what would be smart? What is the actual, like, right edge before you take damage? Let's find that out. But yeah, you're supposed to get some sort of dash upgrade. Let's see here. How close can I get? Oh, the that first close. spike doesn't exist. Yeah. I didn't think it did. It starts with this little wall here. So, like, this is the... This is where you take damage. Yeah, I think this is actually a box. It's deceptive, but it actually is a box. Well, it was much faster than what I did. Where I was trying to do this solo. Damn, that felt close. Yeah, that looked real close. 
I mean, I know you're supposed to come back here with another upgrade, but let's be honest here. Does this look like something you, you should absolutely be forced to do with another upgrade? Oh, that was real good. I think you can pass that little top part of the really... I'm I think, surprised I think how this far part down you went before you died. Yeah, you need to start your jump much later than you think. But like, but that time you didn't go as far because the middle has a higher hitbox for some reason. Like this is higher. This the hurtbox is higher here yeah, I than it is here. For like some reason. that exact big spike that you were floating over. I don't think it exists. No, it's in the background actually. If you look, I, not, if that matters, I think I think you're right. I think that so spike. I think there's a tiny is ignorable. gap. Uh, I'm talking about that spike. Yeah, you just touched it. Touch which one? Yeah, this, you're, this one? No, the one to the right. This one? Yeah, that uh, one. You touched that. Like, your foot went over it. Okay. So this spike is the one that kills me, not the... Yeah. And that's why you were able to go farther down that one time. Right, I see it now, yeah. That, that spike doesn't exist. Right. So you can go into that little gap a little bit, which means that you can start your jump from a little bit lower. I don't know if I have enough room to... It's very to precise that gap. to do it, though. I think I probably physically can't fit in there. See, I don't even know if our hitboxes are that different. It's hard to tell. Damn. Oh, but then you go straight into that, like, jutting down spike. Even with a silly tiny jump. Unless you could, like, get into that gap, jump straight up, and then, move, like, fall left. I mean, yeah, go ahead and check the video, Hated. That's actually a good idea, because I eight months ago, nine months ago, you can just check my channel for Curse of Sea Rats. It, I don't remember what part, but I imagine uh, it's a fairly... You may have also been referring to this video. No, he's checking what's in the chest. He can't check this video for that, because we haven't reached the chest. Oh, it was in the chest. Yeah, he's checking... Because people are saying it's not worth it. And it, oh, may, it, it may be isn't. true. But the reward isn't what's in the chest, it's having completed this. I'm glad you understand that. Whenever I play games of Aragon, if I was doing something like this, he would just think that it was stupid. <laughs> oh, it is. <laughs> oh, it's stupid, sure, but he wouldn't find it entertaining. He wouldn't find it stupid entertaining, he'd just find it stupid dumb. <laughs> <laughs> like, we're already, like, beyond the timer. We are going at this for something that is almost certain. Level up elixir. Wait, that's something you want to save later. Uh, probably. Let's just go back later then. Because the level up elixir, you're going to get more experience the later you level with it. But does it, does it really matter? Are we going to go back to this game? D it depends. Do you want to keep playing this all the way through? I'd do it. I would probably do it just because it's a TF game. <laughs> do you, okay, I'm going to try again. Yeah, there. that really is the key though. I think jumping, like maybe I just need to stop my jump right here. And then try to jump one more time. How about this? Let's leave it to the chat to determine how many more attempts we have. Uh, Make a vote. To, yeah, put it to a poll. So I will continue to do this as people vote. Though these the tips don't count for that. Sixty-nine attempts. Sixty-nine. <laughs> Meme number. Somebody set up a poll and just make all of those arbitrary numbers the option. Man, that was that very was real fucking close. close. <laughs> also, wait, people said I got a level up elixir, so I did make it through, is what you're saying. Hold that thought. Just I'm looking blindly it up. Attacking. Here, watch. Oh, I'm, pull, I'm pulling up. Pull. Thanks, thanks for the timestamp. Timestamp. Mm -hmm. Watch. Watch. Oh, you just you didn't do a double jump that time. No Just double jump. It. No double jump. One single jump. All right. Like oh. that, actually. <laughs> I like how I looked at the video. I was like, okay, and then I just... <laughs> okay, look, give me a shot. Give me a shot. <laughs> I hit it both ways. 
<laughs> give me a shot! Give me a shot! Sure, Essler! I didn't even fucking die on the way back like I expected. Holy shit. Beautiful. <laughs> I like how just watching the video just like, oh, okay, reabsorbs the skills immediately. Like, okay, I don't know it's what the hell. It's when that happens. It wasn't a- it was a bigger jump than that, but smaller jump than Max. The pole is still going. I- I mean- I don't even know what the options are. We can go now. I don't even know what the options are either. I don't see it. What- I- I expected to die to jump back. I was like, impressed enough I immediately did it after watching the- Thanks, Hated! That was really helpful, that time step. <laughs> really, let's go. Let's oh, go ahead. No. <laughs> but the stream is still voting on how many more attempts I have. <laughs> it's because nobody had any faith in me completing it. That's why people were voting, remember. Uh, wait. <laughs> Up is where we came from, right? Yes. Let's go back this way. So how do we find secret walls, then? Fine. Wait, what the fuck's that for? Oh. Increased magic by 25%. Yeah, and we're not going to use the level up elixir. If we're going to play this again, we'll use it later. Because it's going to be more and more effective the later in the game you are. Okay. Now, wouldn't that also just be like a full heal potion, effectively? Yeah, probably. Yeah, literally, it would be. Oh, the spikes there. Oh. <laughs> again, I never could notice okay, where the spikes were in this drop stage. To it is not? Okay. Oh, I think I remember this area too. There was a chest in this area that I couldn't access, it might be here. Go up first. This will be harder to go back up. Yeah. Monies. Check that wall. Oh. <laughs> or, you know, go that way. That's fine, too. <laughs> what a beating. Perfectly coordinated. All right, bye. Okay, oh, yeah. Let's go this way. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> I thought she threw it over. That <laughs> chicken sound. <laughs> seven was the answer. Technically, we did do seven tips while the poll was going. Alright, let's go all the way uh, down. But please tell me, uh, was 69 one of the options? I, I don't know. Somebody tell us. That's a rubber chicken noise. Is that literally? <laughs> yes. How Actually, good point. people voted for it? I mean, I can't pull it up if I tab over here. There. One, oh, you got hit by something. Well, I'm dying. It's fine. Oh, it's a crab. You know, it's the one you should walk away from, Essler. That's that. That's the crab it was. Uh, my punch is a long delay that I can't do anything. Wow, is it that long? Yeah, like I was stuck in my punch animation. Wow. And I can't walk while I'm doing that, because, yeah, like, see? I hit punch, I'm moving right, nope. So there's a chest across the way here. Like, I am holding left. I remember try. oh god. Nope. Bad. <laughs> Not died again. <laughs> So I'm not, that's why I'm not even going for those things on the left. Oh, I got one. Now I can go for it. This jump, I recall that I could I could not get this chest. I recall not being able to. So we're not going to try with this one. Aw. Unless you want to try. Redemption arc. No. <laughs> you drop through the rapid double jump. Wait. Oh, wait, but we can't. No, drop through. Let's That's try what again. I tried the first time. Let me try again. No, you, you do a roll. Yeah, it's slanted, so it's not a drop down. It has to be perfectly straight. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Speedrun tactics. Instead of however long it would have taken you, it instead took a full 10 seconds to get back here. So we want to check out this area more. We uh, the lower paths. One of the lower paths we can now take. I'm jumping down. Jump. I don't remember which one. I can't even see the edge of the fucking ledges. The ledge edge. Oh god. 
That's hurt. I'm sorry. Oh, the trap that I am. Oh, have we been here before? Yeah. Yeah, this is this place. We're coming back here because we should be able to double jump for that chest now. Yeah, can we go up to the left there, though? Is there anything up there? Uh, no, we, there's nothing on the map. We, we've been there, dude. <laughs> So that's the area we could explore last time. Watch out for the spikes above you. No. Okay. Success. I don't want that to go to waste. <laughs> Honestly, the foreground objects and everything, it really just makes it hard to see where the fucking spikes... Again, where the fucking spikes are. You see what I mean? No, I saw them. I want that item. I just didn't get the double jump. For that item. Okay, stay. Stay. Oh! My god. <laughs> didn't think you'd do all of that to go get the item again. <laughs> I was going to edge into it, but all right. You respond very slowly to my statements. Stay. Okay. Just for gold. That was worthless. Alright. Yeah, I think we can go somewhere here, if I recall. Yeah, remember? We can definitely do this. This jump was impossible. Impossible? Yeah, sure. Non possible. Non possible. Impossible. Oh, hi. Watch out. It's a guy. You fight him. Here's a question. That was a human. Why was he the same size as us? We stole his apple, don't worry. You're very good at this. Yeah. <laughs> but you are a hip large hitbox, to be fair. It is as we're done here now. At least for the time being. I mean, keys. So. We need to go back where we came from, actually. Be the Flying best. rat's hole. That's, that's a bat. Ow. That time I did the correct number of punches, so I was able to still move. I hit that guy in his first frame is dashing. That's nice. Huh. It's harder from this direction. Is it? No, maybe not. The angle makes it hard, though. Like, the game is not being friendly with the foreground objects and the angle. So easy to miss these spikes. I had this complaint in the demo, too. Like, this area just doesn't give you enough visual conveyance for the, for the danger. You know? It doesn't. I would like to pick those arms up, but not right now. Just stay still after this. Did you say flail and jump to the left? Die? That is what you generally do. We're like flying sheep hole. <laughs> Let's not talk about animal holes too much. <laughs> oh yeah, I never saw the the explanation for why Wait, bats. Isn't that the chest sheep. I just opened? Hmm? No, that's the other one that we were trying to get. Oh, that's on this. Right, it's in this. Right, it's on the other side. Of the, that's really confusing because it looks like it's in that room, but it also looks like it's in that room. Why is the chest in between the rooms? It's a horrible placement. My God. All right. Um. Coming. Did I just blow your mind by that jump? No. <laughs> you did like a little turd. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, the, the hitbox is a little off from where I thought it would be. Oh, sorry. sorry. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm, the I'm a, as I'm pressing I'm, the button. I'm a chronic map checker. I always forget where I'm going. Like, what's the what's the delay on your attack before you can move? There, there's me moving as fast as I can after the attack. For the same delay, I'd say. Yeah, it looks similar. Or very similar, at least. Okay, let's get out of here. I guess keep an eye out for walls that look weird. Um, let's go... Like, uh, up. the other side of that place. Up first, just to open the room up. Because we didn't open the room up. <laughs> yep, thought so. That was a, a fair amount of money. Oh. Actually, let's go back down. I'm just, like, kind of remembering what I checked out in the demo. We're getting... We're actually getting kind of close to where I left off in the demo. Because, again, I think 30 minutes of the demo was literally that chest. 
Instead of here, it was only 15 minutes or so. Wow. Actually, it's probably longer than 30 minutes. Yeah, the main difference between us is not my attack speed, but simply my... Oh, that's weird. I walk right through that guy, but getting hurt by him. Interesting. God, I, 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 I love how many video games force me to careen off a ledge just to pick up something I that drop from an enemy. God, what is... Again, why do so many games do this? Seriously. That was a good time for that. You're welcome. Let's just look around the room a bit. <laughs> Down first. <laughs> Down first. All right, oh, I, I do have player here. control though, so if you're you're the one that goes off screen. I oh, hear it is. I was, yeah. I was like, there's a drop somewhere. Yeah. The plan was to just let you do that. But then you go off screen, which punch is dangerous. Yeah. Mobs are punched. Loot eruption is triggering an intellectual desire in most people's brain to collect because it's valuable. I mean, it does, but I don't find it fun. Or, well, I, that's weird. Was there a secret path underneath there? I can check this out. Watch out, it's that guy again. He's back. And I have short range. You really just gain his face and beat him, make some stuff attack it, right? Yeah. But look, look at that, look at that range. bullshit. Look at that bullshit. This is why I hate loot explosions. Like, how the fuck did that end over there? Felt like it. The loot grid intensity. See, I get the logic, but. Oh, okay. I feel like I should have lead somewhere. Alright. That's weird. I'm just staying in that guy and he's not harm. Maybe because he came out of a barrel. Like, I think the, the weird part about my attack is not that it has shorter range, but that the range decreases with each punch. God damn it. Just let me know when you, uh, let me know when you're coming back. I'll just, uh, fucking die while you do that. <laughs> it's hard to jump when you can't see yourself. It's easier to see yourself if you don't fall off a ledge. <laughs> it's a counter argument. That sounds dumb. Don't go. A bunch. I remember this. Hey you, buddy, I'm red. Quick, give us a hand. Hand us those keys to Muscle. Oh come on. What only some enemies can inconsistency. I do get the loot gremlin idea, like, oh, loot explodes out, so you want to collect it. I guess that gives some people a, a, a bit of a, you know, a gaming high, I guess. But for me, it's just frustration. It's like, oh, I don't get it. Like, I don't mind fetching things. I'm a dog. But, like, if it's unnecessary fetching. <laughs> it feels like, it feels like, you know, in, like, movies or something, like, somebody's like, oh, you want this thing I have? Go fucking get it. And they just throw it somewhere. Because fuck you, right? It feels like a fuck you in when games do it, too. <laughs> We're comrades. We're all victims here. That doggo does not care about the food or the bone. <laughs> they turned out to be pirates. Doggo's got a job and is a good boy. Us? Pirates? No. We were sailing on a whaler when we were boarded by Flora's ship. And those English souls... Oh, come on, mate. He's give us a little help. This humorous isn't to his liking. But maybe if you got a good femur, the flea bag will drop. Let's hope the chihuahua is. Dog is picky which which boat it gets. <laughs> All right, I'll do my best. Also, they know how to identify bones. Still haven't found a good bone. Get on with it. We don't have. This person wants a rope for some reason. <laughs> I'm not going down, but I just was like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna totally hit this person. Uh, <laughs> to be fair, I am harming some of your jumps, I guess. <laughs> you keep doing it as I'm hitting the jump button. Again, I, I'm i chronically a map checker, I'm sorry. So anyways, that'll meet up to here some point, but... Wait, what's this drop down? Oh wait, no, that's right, that's where we came from. Do 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 do. Pirates of the Caribbean reference. Ah. Oh, hi. I forgot about you. This guy's not important enough for a cutscene. Huh? Yeah. Oh, hey, it's me. Ow, I'm dead. Oh, the double jump makes it a little easier to dodge things. Wait, what? Yeah, that didn't really work, what I was doing. But I just like, no help, actually. Guess he wasn't that dangerous after all. Alright, off we go. 
Uh, bye. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hmm. I don't even know. Okay, it's just a place you can go if you feel like it. Used to be, I mean, he kind of still was. The camera walked and there was music. All right, that's an exit. Let's go over here. It's like place. a mini boss. Yeah. It's doing that. Whoa. Why am I sliding left? I don't know. You're the one controlling your character. No, I'm not. <laughs> like, I'm holding left and I just slide off oh. to the right. We can just immediately go back for that, but let's clear that. Uh, that's first. a tasty bone. We were asked for a good bone. That's, that's probably a. Uh oh. <laughs> I feel like the best strategy of a lot of enemies is just to bum rush the fuck out of them so they can't do their attack. Sandwich. Why can't you give the dog the sandwich? I bet that would be work too. Well, the dog didn't want bread. <sighs> How picky. Wait, we missed a chest? Okay, let's go back down. For two reasons, really. Well, that is fast. My goal right now is to complete the section I play in the demo to see if it was any different from the demo. Oh, down. More monies. Oh, so I feel like we get most money from chests. Meanwhile, like, enemies give like two. Sorry, that just looks like a secret area. I don't know. Doesn't it? Like, it just feels weirdly, like, avoided to walk through. Uh, okay. Actually, wait, I didn't realize we took a new exit. That's fine. Let's walk first. I was already a heavy. Oh. Chickens explode. Sure did. Feel the despair growing inside yeah, that's nice. We can upgrade. Dude, we don't need a Lincoln Park house. Come on. <laughs> oh, there yeah, we go. I'm sure did this again. I don't know why I want to go down too. I just do. For some reason. Oh, uh, we lost a bunch of monies. Yeah, we have to go get it. It's like mo it's more than half. Wait, where do we die? Uh, off the map, maybe? I. <laughs> You know, there's an icon for it, except for when there's not, I guess. She explodes if it wants to explode, by the way. So a lot of inconsistencies we're seeing. We're seeing hitboxes sometimes on hurtboxes on enemies touching them, touching enemies. But wait, where was the where was the where were the where were the bone people? Since we can just drop that off. It was down. Yeah. It's one of the dead ends. It's a dead dead end room. The dead room. Was it up here or was it down there? Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, to be fair, I didn't see the enemy spawn. I keep forgetting he's there. He's either they're either here or a little more above. Yeah, okay, so you don't move forward when you attack, but you do push enemies back. Alright, let's go get it. Sheesh. I was just gonna get him right, uh, go back up. Actually, did, you either got a really fast or a despawn, I can't tell which. And that's fair, but like, I'm just pointing out how annoying it is, that's what I'm saying. Boom. My, you did it! Come on, quick! Give us. Nah. Forced to. Oh, actually, oh we're... no, Doggo just ceased to exist. As dogs Too do when happy. Eat bones. Oh, the Keystone has an item? Alright. Oh, they're there. I mean, something else to use them on. They're definitely not fishermen. Ow. You have died. You know, that would honestly be funny. Uh, I think I did that last time too, but the question is, do Good. you get a, uh, I hope we don't get it back, because you, you're going to spend that on wool. 
That is a little bit frustrating, though. Um, what do we do with that exactly? I would yeah, like to announce fun. that I finally have internet that isn't a potato. That, well, that's that good to hear, well. Hyper. That took you like what six years? Um, <laughs> good to hear, though. Hold on a second, check it out. <laughs> yeah, that was literally the only purpose of that. Um, did, did we get our money back? <laughs> Hopefully not. Okay, memes aside, though, think about it from a game design standpoint. <laughs> I honestly, like, before that happened, I was going to say, I think it would be funny if this, like, clear, like, really obviously this is a group of pirates who want to hurt you group that you are freeing just killed you. And that was the only reward for that side quest. Dying would have been less of a pro- wait, hold on, speak of dying, where's our stuff? Uh, left, I believe. So speak of resources more important than money. Is that over here? Uh, yeah, I think we went th yeah, yeah, this way. Is it where we, yeah. Um, I don't know if you... That's how long it took her in IFG to be... So basically, you got better internet because finally it was no longer a monopoly. Yeah, it sounds about right for America. I'm glad you got that. That's the chicken that killed us. So where's the money? Where's the experience? So it just disappeared. We we just lost everything, and that's it. Oh well. So we also lost our buddy, and we lost all the experience too. One of those things was the game its intentions, and one of those was a glitch. Barely break them. No, I know what the return whistle does. It takes us back to the store. Yeah. Shell with star. It's a key item. No, there's no item that lets you keep your stuff. You're supposed to pick it up again, but I think it glitched out. There's still that... There's still that space mistake there, too, on the lamp, I just realized. I remember that, too. Laura, when did we get that? Oh, I think, oh, I think we got that because of the pirate thing. I don't know, though. I think. And then we have the shell, which... Yeah. Seems to dry easily. Dries easily. Probably just a glitch. So it makes up a glitch and a bad gameplay decision. It's a little frustrating to me when I play a demo for a game, like, th that I'm trying to review, right? I'm officially reviewing a demo, and then later I officially review the full release. And I can't tell a motherfucking difference between the two. Like, there's, like, nine months have passed. Nine months have passed. I'm sure they developed the game further, but as far as improving what was already there, um, improving glitches, etc., I don't see much here. Or even minor spelling mistakes. That time it exploded. And it's a little uh, disappointing to see that. It sucks when you like notice some r real issues of refinement in a in a video game that's a demo, and you're like, well, they'll probably fix it for the full release. No, that that's the lighthouse. We don't need to go that way yet. Okay. That's actually where the demo pretty much ended, so we're almost to the demo endpoint, which is, again, kind of like my goal. Let's go this way. But also, I, I don't know, I mean, do we get the money back? I mean, there's some RPGs and stuff that are like, ah, they took all your money, but then you get it back later, so it's like, whatever. I will probably find them again. There's a key for, the, I remember that too, we can go down there for that too. Yeah. Lighthouse will be the end goal, kind of, for this stream, uh, because... Like, so that's kind of where I remember it stopping before. Let's see. Yeah, there are some basically very basic things. There's some very basic things the demo should have allowed. Like, I even, I mean, I gave a review then. We're going to go up and right. I had to scratch below my ear. Okay, I thought you were not sure where I was going, which is fair. Oh, I can't go up and right. Here. I'll just murder that guy then. No, that, that goes to the White House. Yeah, I was wondering why we were going back up there. I did Again, this is why I checked the map chronically. I had very bad at directions. It's really 
weird how the chickens just sometimes explode. Was there one right here? There was a, that guy right here. What, what's your point? This is, this is where we died. Oh. So all that experience we lost, we could have just amused it. We were right next to a dude where we could have used it. Hold on a second. I gotta, I gotta check something. I'm a little annoyed now. Um, oh, actually, wait. Hold on. Hated. Could you do me a favor, man? Since you were already viewing the video anyways. Also, it would be your spending. Since you were already viewing the video anyways, could you check that video of my demo playthrough? I am pretty sure I had all my money stolen in that, too. Could you just check to find that moment and see if I got the money back in some way? You're good, I guess? Yeah, we don't have enough for my next thing. So I need 2,400 to get a meaningful upgrade. Worth the check, I figure. So, also, um... I, I know that we're all just kind of like, oh, it's a glitch and moving on, but let's stop for a second here. The This is a game that has a Souls-like a souls -like difficulty of you drop your experience when you die. I, I'm i just going to say this straight out, but I am pretty sure that if in a game that you drop your experience when you die, you should not at all be able to encounter a glitch where it just disappears. I'm sorry, but can you imagine if Dark Souls just... Can you remember, imagine if Dark Souls just... Here, I'll let you do it first. Can you imagine if Dark Souls just randomly... Oh, I guess today the experience just didn't exist. I guess... Oh, I died right here, but... And I know I did, but... I guess my experience just uh, vanished this time. Or imagine, like... Oh, I, I knocked this enemy a pit and he was unique enemy. I guess I just don't get his stuff he drops or something. Can you imagine how Dark Souls would have been received if you could just randomly not get your souls back? That's where a glitch has Well, I'm sure the glitch has happened, but like that's not saying you leave in for a full release, or at least, at the very least, you, you repair it quickly. Oh, that's fine. Let's just take different paths. I got money. And I'm sorry, I'm still like wondering to myself here. Oh, we're back. That's interesting. Okay, you know what? <laughs> okay, I guess you just don't want me to jump. Ah, okay. Um. Check you canceled those. two consecutive jump inputs. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Elden Ring is trying to drop glitches as well first. Yeah, but like, again, I think these glitches... I don't remember why I any of these glitches back in the demo, but... Safe to say... Like, I just... I, I guess it's like this. If a company's gonna release a demo literally months before... Oh, that's right, we got that. Literally months before the game releases for full, I would expect the full release to have had a quite a few refinements at that point. Because isn't the point of releasing a demo to get feedback, to find glitches, and no, you know, to create hype, solve that so the full when the full release happens, it's actually rather well refined. I thought that's the point. Yeah, nobody wants to learn lessons. Is there a teleport room nearby? Uh, you'd think that, but probably kind of, probably this way. Not oh, I remember that. I remember we could not be able to go very far. Yeah. This that area. Um Let's wriggle our way back down and check one of these locks cuz we, we have a key. We have a key. But yeah, I I legitimately that way you don't have to go all the way. I do have to look, there's the the flying rats area has no teleport. It doesn't fucking matter. <laughs> to put it very simply. <laughs> right, this weird place where there's just nothing. Unless, of course, there's one behind one of the locked doors we're about, though, which is quite possible. Uh, we just want to drop down and go left, so. Whee! Oh. You can kill that guy if you want. I do. I always want. Uh, uh, I was going to kill that other guy. One near the lighthouse. I don't... <laughs> buy that box. Um, huh. <laughs> I'm just pondering that for a second. Like, yeah, I just kind of went right through the platform. All right. Uh, yeah, so, just over here. Car, it's one of those fallacies of, oh, I could save time if there's a teleport point nearby, but I don't know if there fucking is, so I could waste my time looking for it and then end up wasting more time. Like, imagine, it, it's a cost fall sunk cost fallacy, right? 
Oh, if I keep advancing, I might hit a teleport point, and then I can easily travel back and forth to where I actually want to go right now. So maybe I shouldn't go back to where I want to go. Maybe I should keep going forward. Sunk cost fallacy, though, because if you don't run into the teleport, now you have to walk even further to go to the place you want to go first. But are you sure that we've been to the area, like, below and to the left? What do you mean? Like, that area on the lower left corner Here? of the screen. Um, no. Here? Like, on the screen. Here? There. What? Esther literally just pointed off the map and asked yeah, if we not, haven't been there. Yeah, I guess not. <laughs> no, Since it's not deep on underground. The not on the map. Oh, where? On the screen. Oh, on the screen itself. Yes. Oh, uh, yeah? That's where we... Do you not remember me doing the fancy jump here? This is uh, why I did yeah, the fancy but jump. Have we been on the left of here? I... Yeah? I mean, not, you're not going to get much for... Here, let me... Yeah, this goes to the jumpy thing. Ah, and I okay. jump up here, and then I go... This is... I mean, we... Sure, well, let's go this way, but... <laughs> we definitely need to go down, though, so that's not a useful path. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if I'm better or worse at maps than you. Hmm, that was dangerous. See, we don't want to die. We don't want to die because it can just glitch out, apparently. Like, we all we did was die on a flat plane to a chicken. Like, I get that so like, losing it, like... But it wasn't on the map, so maybe that's what the difference is. What do you mean it wasn't on the map? Uh, that room was not on the map when we came back, because we lost all of our map progress, I think. No. You don't lose map progress. If we did, that was part of the glitch. My point is, though, we died on a flat plane, on a flat surface, to a chicken. It wasn't like some weird fucking death where we glitched into a wall with spikes. <laughs> where I'd be like, alright, fair enough, we lost in that situation. No, we just died on a fucking floor. Nothing unusual about that death. The only way the parts where they did a demo it didn't look like you found them. Oh, I didn't actually, so I didn't actually trigger the money, I didn't actually trigger the whole they steal your money thing? Huh. Alright, fair enough, I just never encountered that. I I'll try again. That's rude. Single jump, I think, for this one. Yeah. No, you're dead. Oh, okay. What was my opinion at the end of that video? Did I, so I'm assuming I never got my money back, right? Yeah, it's a single jump. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'll, I'll just try. Let's just hope. <laughs> oh, motherfuck. Now it's up there. Okay. Let me just hop up there then. Fuck, fuck money doing this. Is there a reason, game, that I can't do that jump? Come over here. Oh, you got it for me. There we go. Oh, okay. We did it. You found the bone long before you found them. Lost 3,500-ish. And I never got it back, I assume. Alright, the other door. Also, this is a fun thing, because there's two locked doors, and I have a key for the flying... Does it specify, actually? The door to the flying rat's hole. I mean, yeah, cool. There's two, so... But it's the door to this place. That's a good this question. Place. I'm a little. I'm simply wondering. Is, is that the right door too? I don't even know. Yeah, we're here. I, I think I did this. I'm pretty sure I unlocked this. Yeah, there we go. So it could have been a little more clear, like, locks, unlocks, oh, don't walk into that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what I'm wondering right now is, like, this ghost thing that we're doing, is, does this have to do with, like, the amulet, or is this just a thing we can do? I just would like, honestly, I would like to, I can't form a full, I'm pissed off about the money thing, but I can't form an opinion. Because I need to know, do you get that back? <laughs> because as far as I can tell, they just left, and I don't know where they are now, so... You know, other RPGs like, oh, they stole your money, but, oops. Oh. Let's not stand in the same place. <laughs> <laughs> not around baths. I'm blocked for you. Oh, look, our stuff is there this time. That's nice. Good. I'll try to walk all the way back down. We're just trying to farm a little bit more money. How the hell did that hit me? I was far away. Blast rays is bigger than it actually visibly shows. Okay, so we don't want to know what we actually want. 
Can you remember the map without me opening it? Are you better at the map? Not really. Okay, then. I'm a chronic map tracker. Uh, tracker. You you also are, so. I just don't have to hear because you're doing it more than I would. It's down, 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 down on the left. Not there. So that leads to that. Your uppercut doesn't go as Yeah, I know. Really annoying. Yeah, I just noticed that. <laughs> All you said that, that was low again. after they sold you money, you didn't really seem to care. I probably didn't care because I was playing a demo. <laughs> That's probably the reason. <laughs> Either that or I had just bought the expensive wool and it didn't matter to me. I don't. Did I lose a whole bunch? Three, five hundred. I lost thirty five hundred at the time. I think I lost yeah. more then than I did this time. Yeah, you only lost one thousand five hundred this time. So I didn't even lose as much. Just watch out. <laughs> Ow. How squeak your game so far? What? Why did you attack? What? I was gonna say that's completely on you for I was holding right! And attack, apparently. No! I didn't my finger wasn't even on the button. This isn't actually the right way to go. Alright, hold play. on. I need to test something. Okay. Don't worry, you're still on screen. You're fine. No, I, I can't see what I'm trying to test, though. Alright, hold on. Delay input? See, that would make sense if we weren't literally playing right next to each other on local co-op with his own controller plugged in. There should be no reason oh, for Oh, yeah! Way... What? Unless his controller is just completely shit or something. There shouldn't be any reason for delayed input. Yeah, if I press the attack button at any point during my uppercut animation, I will do another attack afterwards. I cannot stop it. There's no way to cancel out of that. So if I'm just spamming the attack button until they die, ah. then the attack that kills them, I will always do an extra one. So I just checked. I don't have that issue. I can do. I can always stop at every t attack. I just. I just observed that. So oddly enough, that is a that is a dumb issue for your character to have. So yeah, I I'm I'm disappointed because whenever I play a cool game that has some flaws for a demo, like I have done several de demo releases, uh, demo checks. Oh, literally the same enemy. <laughs> I was gonna say whenever he is. <laughs> That's why I paused for a second. I was like, where is that bat? But yeah, I, I personally, listen, I care about video games, guys. I care about developers. I care about the development of good video games. It's part of the reason I'm so critical of games. And so when I play a demo, especially for Halo for an Hour, because I don't play demos for Halo for an Hour very often. I'll do it if I feel like a game is special. This game seems special. Metrovania involving Rack TF, that seemed pretty cool. So I was like, I'll check out the demo for this, and then I'll check out the full key when it releases later. And that's what I'm doing. But when I checked out the demo, I was critical of things. Um, and I was like... This is fine, though, because it's a demo. They can fix these things. They can refine these from release. And indeed, they had plenty of time. I mean, I know they were also developing the rest of the game, but nine more months to develop this. They had time to refine things. It's always disappointing to me when I play a demo, I see some need for improvement, and then I play the full release, and I'm still like, nothing's changed, you know? I will be critical of that, because they had warning. They released the demo, if they bothered to watch the reviews of the demo, they would know what's up with common complaints, and then they didn't fix them, and that's just very disappointing to me. One of them made the game feature complete and pushed it out in order to make it on time. That quite possible. Uh, I do remember a fight here. If I rec oh yeah, Correct. we can fight Dracula here. Oh I yeah, I vaguely remember, remember that? that guy. Oh, yeah, it's Dracula. You have the other part of the eye of the serpent, don't you? Give it back to me. Future patches will fix these problems. Quite possible, but I'm always a little unsettled by the idea of release it now, fix it later. I don't. I'm not fond of that strategy. I know it's not always the decision of the developer, though. No, I'm gonna beat you up. I don't have time for this. Morat, take care of this scum and get the amulet back for me. She has some really weird allies. It's kind of like a Metal Gear Solid. Big boss, you know, that has all the like. Yeah. Well, there's a for example, Melgar Soul 2. 
the President of the United States just happens to employ a vampire too, so you know. Yeah, yeah. Hi. Welcome to my humble encampment. It is not everything. I mean, don't worry, I'll make sure to activate my damage boost real early into this. I mean, it does make sense here because Flying Rat Cave, but. Unfortunately, your adventure must end here. My sincerest apologies that I cannot show you the hospitality of the Ottomans with a cup of chai. There's a reason High Five Rush is so popular. It's a complete game that was released. Yeah, it's. It's completely polished, you're right. Cannot be helped, however. My appetite is high, and I have my orders. Have at you! You messed that up! Voice actor, you have to say, ENOUGH TALK! HAVE AT YOU! <laughs> that is required, to say the full line. What the fuck? He only said half of it! That ruins it! Well... Oh yeah, that's right, he's, a bit, he's a bit of a bastard. Um, Got him. Alright, activate my damage boost. I will try to not die. From my focus. Well, what are you doing? Get away. Oh, okay. It's not like a timing thing. Oh, the diggers go everywhere. Careful. Zoom. Ready to jump. Oh wait, no, never mind. Well, I'm still right about that. My focus is not dying. My focus is dying. Oh, this guy doesn't wait. This guy doesn't hurt me when he touches me. Watch out, dagger three directions. He does have contact damage. It's just smaller. I wonder if he can duck that. I think it's just occasional, actually, his contact damage. Oh. No. These bats. Uh, would you like to just die? Okay, thank you. I guess? <laughs> Can you jump this though? What the hell's he doing? Uh, I don't know. Whoa, whoa, why am I going light? What? I, I don't, don't know. know! What are you doing? I, I don't know! I was I was holding no movement button. Could you hit me? Thank yeah. you. <laughs> I was not pressing any movement button. I don't you believe you, sir. To the right. Actually, wait. Is your controller is your controller fucked at any time? Is it a fucked controller? Does it get fucked with other games? Tell not, me. No, not that I've ever noticed before. Well, my controller is fine, so that's the thing that's weird. Maybe they, maybe there's something wrong with the co-op second player controls. That is such an easy to dodge attack. It's like he's not even trying. He's like, I'll do it again. <laughs> Actually, he's quite. This guy does actually telegraph his attack, so. Yeah, see, like, he just phased through me. That st side. Oh. Gotta stay out of the side on that one. Watch out for the beggars. Okay, so he hurt you there. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh god damn it. I was murdered by feet. If I were not stuck in the amulet, I'd show them a thing or two. Yeah, I'd like to know. Let's go up. I bet there's a teleport here. If they didn't put a teleport there, they're mean. Let's try it again. I, I don't remember this guy taking me that many tries, actually. I think... I mean, we should be able to feed him this time. He's not hard. Not really. Yeah. But I'd like to know what your controller is doing. Yeah, same. Because I hope it's not going bad. Because it sure seems like it's going bad. Well, this... This is my 360 controller from my 360. That's pretty old. I assume. I am able to buy. I like. I used to buy for the resistor controllers. I'm now forced to buy Xbox One controllers because I can't get 360 controllers anymore. I like 360 controllers a little bit more. They have better D-pad. So that is a controller I would swear by. Like, but if it's super old, maybe not. Ow. <laughs> Sorry, I do need it. It's then down, it's down all the way. Remember those jumps? You, some of them you don't even need to make. Oh, I figured it out. Watch this. Left down. Not holding left. Left anymore. down. Ah, wait, hold on. If you hold down, you keep moving in the direction you were moving. Are you doing that? Oh, okay, I just did it. Yeah. 
Wait. That's what happened. So the difference here is simple. I'm using the analog stick. You're using the D-pad. Yeah. And D-pad controls are fucked. That's the difference, guys. Actually, now that I think about it, why am I using the analog stick? Yeah, I don't know. Usually you would use D-pad for games like this. That's why I'm doing that. It feels fine on analog, though. Hey, try analog. Uh, no, I, no, I can't play like that. No, it's for the sake of the review. Check, uh, check to see if your controls just improve with analog, okay? No, they never... No! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> You're whining more than that crab is screeching. My goodness. <laughs> Ow. It just feels wrong. Get the level up save point for going to the fight. Uh, we could. That one there. I wish I should just hit. We should just hit that a upper. Two D game? No, you don't use an analog stick for a two D game. Well, it depends on the. T it depends on the game. Where are you going? Good question. Also, oh, let's take the top room rather than the lower room this time. I was gonna uh, say he immediately chat charges, so watch out. Yeah, which makes them easy. Wait. Oh no! I'm sorry. <laughs> that was my fault entirely. I'm sorry. I was chronic map checker, man. <laughs> yeah. See, it's a door. It's a fucking oh, it's, it's a door. I don't like spade. I, I don't like spade for the doors. I think that's stupid. I am. That, that'll save some time. Go ahead. Are you using the analog stick? Using, Tell me, do you have that yeah, issue with the analog stick? I'm using the... Really? I can't no. seem to activate it at all with the huh. analog. The analog stick seems fine. Yeah, okay, that just it doesn't exist with the analog stick. I was gonna stick. say, he's gonna immediately charge, so FYI, but... Also, I'm upset by uh, not hated suggesting I do this for an entire game, knowing that that would definitely be Lana Lana. Side. He actually has proper tells for all his yeah. attacks. I would actually wait till he throws the daggers before attacking him here, but then again, he doesn't move right afterwards. No, uh, I, I do that at that point, so that I can dodge the daggers. Wait, what? Oh, he interrupted him. I think this is like super form, he's gonna do crazy stuff or something. I don't know. What? What hit me? Ineptitude? <laughs> did, I, did I get hit by like the little <laughs> That's all I can think of. I actually don't know what you got hit by. Watch out, take it. How did you get hit by jump. that? I jumped. I am jumping. <laughs> Just jumping in the opposite direction. Oh wow, he appeared in the bats and then he didn't. <laughs> Crazy. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh, that is his, he does have a super form, I was right. Watch out! Down below. Watch out! <laughs> Down below a different way. Watch outside. Watch out, Roar. Watch out, middle. Oh. Apparently. Huh. Oh, that's so fucking and rude. And then he does the daggers. So you have to go into the blind spot. <gasps> Nope. <laughs> so close. So when he's throwing uh, lots of daggers, we if we're on both sides of him, he can't attack one of us. Do we have any stuff? He's ain't angry at us. <laughs> what? Do we have any soul juice, though? We do. You could try activating it if you want. That would probably be... You just, like, check. jumping. Like, I can't interact really with this. I, I don't know. It's <laughs> like, check if you want. <laughs> But uh, now it would pit. All right, you know what, Car? We'll do it your way. All right, we're going up. We'll, we'll do big dolls this and have it your way. Cause you know what? Fair enough, Car. Let's let's check Car's theory. We're gonna check Car's theory now. The what if you keep going and hit a teleport point? Now a teleport point would actually matter a lot more. So sure, let's check. But where's the nearest teleporter to that guy? There. Oh, right there. But see how there that goes up here? I think you can actually maybe go that this way. Instead. Read checkpoint room near the boss fight, you don't need to go far. 
Oh! Yeah, I didn't think about that. I'm sorry. I was just thinking, you, you said you should spend your souls. I was like, I don't need to spend souls. I did not, however, think about, yeah, if we just entered that room, we'd start there every time we died. I kind of forgot about that fact. Oh. You didn't think about that either, right? Because this that is the last... Help. Yeah, I didn't think about that <laughs> at all. Oh. Never say anything about spending room. souls. I could have sworn you did. No. Hold on, let me check. Suggestion, hit the level up save point before going to the fight. Oh, no, no, you said hit the level up save point before going to the fight. I quickly skimmed it because I'm streaming. And I was like, hit the level up. I'm like, oh, I don't need a level up. You said level up slash save point. If you had said save points slash level up, you may have made me think about it. But you said level up. You said level up slash save point, so I only read level up. <laughs> You gotta talk to a streamer straightforwardly. <laughs> Though I do think there might be a warp actually over here, so. Let's... Yes, we are. We are. We are indeed. <laughs> Your eloquence won't be denied. Like, I just read the first word and went off of that. Oh god. Well. Sometimes the chickens are just immediately wanting murder, and sometimes they're not. Okay, I guess I'm not doing a full jump today. Also, part of the reason we're dying so much is I'm just flabbergasted watching Esther mess up things. I'm using an analog stick now. Where am I? I no longer care. <laughs> like, my own skills are suffering watching his. <laughs> Yep, see you later, I guess. <laughs> I can't activate the double jump! Because I, I hit the wall. You're welcome. I left so quickly you didn't die and lose all your HP. You're welcome. Esler is doing the best. This is true. I'm really not, though. I... Said it, I heard it from him. <laughs> so the demo stopped at the lighthouse. It just, like, prevented me from going for it. Hello, kitty. Yeah, this is my it. initial response to cats. No! There we go. Maybe. Drop me down here. That's a very grizzled cat. Pushing that. Yep, that's what I did. Yeah. Check the white right wall, actually. Yeah, see, it does look oh. different. Look at it. Look at it. See. I was like, aha. My. Oh, how's that? Lock back. Use open certain locked doors, breaks upon use. Oh, like, so it's like a small key. Maybe the other flying rat door? Aha. Uh -huh. Now the other side of the door. Oh, you can't hit the, it's, the board supporting it. You have it's, to hit the wall itself. <laughs> It's that is such a video game trope. Like, oh, this wall is blocked, but you see how they're supporting boards on the other side. If you hit those, you can open the shortcut. So it took that logic, right? It took that logic of, oh yeah, just break the supporting boards, but it didn't make you break the supporting boards. It just wanted you to hit the fucking rock for the other side. <laughs> Good kitty is safe. The door is locked. So how do I know which lock picks doors can unlock? Like, what doors I can unlock well, the lock picks? What? You're not touching that kitty. Okay, I guess we can go this way. Uh, there's an item up there. Oh. Hey, you know. Where? Uh, I don't know. Let's, let's go ahead. Let's go. I need to get some pussy. Hold on. No. That's so fun to hear yowl. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Also, maybe here, by the way. Now it's here. What? Meanwhile, this oh. is where the. Okay, this is new. I think. Okay, I spider rat. What the fuck? Wait for short fuse to light the bonfire. I have a tummy ache. I just said we're working on it, but I'm so hungry. Damn it, short fuse! If you don't get that fire going now. I'm going to explode. I'm on it, I'm on it! We should cut him adrift! 
We'd sail a mic faster and wouldn't have to listen to this bawling. You're on a once, ship. <laughs> I agree with the half meter. Oh, there's a furry bait. I figured there would be one of them somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we got the cream. Oh, more furry bait. Man, she has a lot of furry bait crew, doesn't she? And arguably Fats was furry bait too, depending on who you ask. My little bro's right. All of this whining will make my skin break out. Okay, so that's Since gonna be a duo boss at some point, probably. Here. Yeah. I've said he's not to be touched. And that's the last I'm so Wait, where's the vamp I guess he's just way in the cave so he can't be in this cutscene. <laughs> so we need to block our <laughs> block our path. Short fuse. No, you fool. The child. I am surrounded by idiots. I'm glad that we saw that. I'm glad that it costs so much to unlock the teleports, but at least I did find teleport. What did I what did I say? You wanna do this? No reason not to, I suppose. Uh, do we want to go to the other save point instead? Sure. Oh, or we can go back to the start where there's a save point next to a teleport. That probably is the most sensible. And also we'll be at the start. In case there's anything that we need to do here. Oh, smart. You know, that's I'm, that's very nice of you. I'm glad that you want to go get the, uh, the, the wool. <laughs> do we have that much money? I hope not. <laughs> very smart of you to suggest no! that. No! No! <laughs> it's just like dying down there. Uh, I was actually murdering the down there. Same sounds. <laughs> Would you like to buy something? Yes. Oh, I thought I had more. Okay then. <laughs> Anyways, that's cr I could have sworn I said I had fifteen hundred somewhere. Huh. No, that's my. That's the other thing. Okay. Uh, when you lost. We need to actually touch the save point, though. For this yeah, I guess strategy so. to work. What if it actually needs to be interacted with? Probably. Well, it has been. Can we get up there from here? Nope. <laughs> Is there anything you need to buy? Nope. Because all the money's downstairs, I don't care. I'll buy post money the boss fight, not before. Well, what if it helps you win the boss fight? Oh. <laughs> Man. It'll help me win the next there boss fight. There goes that one little orb. Check your map, I have a theory. Map. Whee. That's 20% of it, by the way, if you're curious. That's one-fifth of the game. Character exchange stream may have eaten your previous souls before. I see your logic, Maybe? but considering souls are saved, like, completely... We don't have individual soul stocks, so there's no reason why that should break it. True. But maybe that's you might why be right, it though. does break it. I feel like you might be right. the developers never tried to test that. Like, we literally just share the same soul pool, so that should not... Change your character should mean nothing, but... You might be right. Because I think you're right. I think I did dump dick, uh, dick, dip into that. <laughs> dick around with that menu, I think is what I tried to say. <laughs> Remember, he charges. Good work. I wanted to hit him. I wanted to try ducking. Okay, it definitely doesn't work. That was my fault, I just got greedy. I was like, well, if I'm the only one gonna hit him, then I'll just... <laughs> I'll just do extra damage. Hit him once, run away. And then hit him again. And then hit him several more times. And then keep hitting him. Oh, that hits me? Because he went into the fucking animation, right? That's rude. Who is 
tell what he's going to do based on his animations. Daggers. Yep. Oh, if you stay really close to him, you can just jump it, I guess? Yeah. Or underneath him, too. I was doing that. I wasn't expecting it at that time. Do me a favor. No. Live. He's necessarily tried to not for a second there, I noticed. Ah, so. uh, the middle. The middle. And then immediately dodge. Or... He's practically dead. Just don't dodge, please. Just keep moving. Gotcha. Sorry, you're basically dead. What the fuck are you doing? Get out of here. Get out of the fucking <laughs> floor. And then he hit us on contact while moving through the cutscene and we I, died. Hey, Kyrio, did you catch This is not possible! Hey, Kyrio, were you here for when I checked out the demo of this like eight months ago? I'm gonna guess you noticed that this is the furry TF game. <laughs> Sorry, Flora. May the night give me shelter. The shadows take pity on me. I don't remember if you. We just had a meet the crew scene. I'm sorry you missed that. You missed a bunch of furry bait. Oh, we got dashing now. Oh, that's how you. Yeah, that's how you're supposed to get that. Is okay. he? Is he dead? Uh, is there an instruction on how to do that? Um, nope. We have it though. It's not a double tap. Uh, I guess it. Um. Oh. Um. Sidestep in midair. It <laughs> looks normal. Okay, mine right, has right, like a, a rush of... Right button? Things. Is right button what you're doing? Yeah, right bumper. Okay, so that's my dash? <laughs> like, yeah, what? So we have like different dashes. So Wait a minute. Stop. This is a music clip that's supposed to play once when a thing happens and then it stops. <laughs> Oh, he's still dying. <laughs> he's still dying! He's just oh stuck no. Dying. Are we stuck on oh, the screen? No. <laughs> Is it because he died like. What, is there treasure over here? No. Oh, wait, you can go off the screen, so we can both die. This seems kind of a polish. Yeah, it. Cairo, I checked this game out for Halloween for an hour nine months ago, noted a bunch of things that were wrong with it. In the course of playing this, I lost, we lost, so this has a Dark Souls system of dropping your souls. Randomly, a ton of our souls just dropped and disappeared. Like, just stopped existing. We can't, we don't know entirely sure why. Uh, but I, when I checked this game out nine months ago in its demo farm, I noted a bunch of refinement issues, including, like, just simple stuff, like, like, if I go down to the... Spelling mistakes. Like this, like, still illuminate, or... Or my skill being called water, W H A T E R, and I noticed these mistakes back on the demo nine months ago. I was like, "That's fine. They'll probably refine it." I play the full release here. I'm like, "Bitch, you didn't refine shit. <laughs> like, at least not the stuff I found." Uh, let's try leaving the room. Yeah, I'll go first. Well, if it doesn't work, cool. Oh, he just used to tell us how to do it. So I think what. <laughs> yep. He's still he's still alive. We, we got his him. experience, by the way. I'd like to know. Yeah, we're just duping XP now. I mean, we might die, but who cares? Yeah. Side. <laughs> Wait, I can hit, but he's just like in that form. Okay. Huh. Oh. Ah. <laughs> What? He cornered me. Can I get another dash of it? Can I get a double dash? Oh, we're gonna get Mario Kart double dash. Mario Kart double dash, come on. Give me another dash, friend. A lot of daggers. Oh, he threw it my way. I guess that's good for me. Okay. Okay, yeah, he just turned around and started throwing daggers at me, and then my corpse. Uh, sight. Yeah. 
Oh wait, just standing underneath them seems pretty safe in this situation. Not for him. It's <laughs> <And laughs> like a little casually gun. killing the boss twice. It was not by my hand I was once again granted life. Kyra, <laughs> that is the best line ready for this situation. <laughs> that is wonderful. Sorry. Are you gonna die this time? Hooray, right, more dashing! Yay! Yay! <laughs> oh, I don't know if he was worth anything that time. I don't know if he was worth anything the first time because he didn't drop the experience. Well, but... we got the old XP back. Yay! Uh, do we want to spend all that now? <laughs> it's not even that much. 4,762. Oh, it's no, I want to go over here. a lot more than we've ever had. Come on. Okay, there's nothing there. There's nothing there. I, my goodness, the lack of polish in this. <laughs> Guys, seriously, it, it just feels like since the demo, they did nothing to polish any, anything. Also, I actually want to go up the normal way. Let's go to the level room to the left, because... I want to check to see if that door can be unlocked. Also, we're collecting their teeth as we're defeating them. Oh, right. Oh, ooh. Got him. Nice. I forgot about him for a second. Same, but he did a giant screech. Go back. He might be there again. Probably not, because he actually <laughs> no, properly died. No, because he did died. die. I mean, I could check if you want. Got him. Though it would be good if he came back in, because that means more experience. No, he's, he's actually no, he's, dead this he's time. He's actually dead now. So wait, your dash lets you just charge forward, but I have to like turn a I have to turn away because mine's a you're, mine's you're, a back oh you mine, have a back look, step. It's a back step. <laughs> so I don't even get a that's not even technically a dash when you think about it. Okay, I don't no, think we mine can get gives that. me any further we, horizontal movement. We're gonna go back there anyways because we can totally get that treasure now. Got him. now. We can totally get that treasure now. By the way. With our, with my stupid back step, I could get it too, but you have easier time. So, up. I don't know if it actually gives me any more horizontal movement. So I kind of just fall. It is really- Yeah, it doesn't give me any additional movement. Watch me. Yours does. <laughs> I was just like, it's a boy for that. Yeah, mine doesn't. It just forces me to go forward. But it if you look, if you look at me, to do so. if you look at me using it in midair, it doesn't even look right, right? Yeah, it looks really weird. It looks like I'm not supposed to be able to. This is what happens when you pay your animators and not your programmers. That's a good point. So even <laughs> then, Cairo, there's a problem with the number of the bosses. First off, a lot of bosses do contact damage, which I don't think is terribly fair in this game, especially considering. Yeah, I guess so. Um. Let's go up first, though. Get that treasure. Um, so, so, yeah, that door was... So, it's also impossible to tell which doors we can lockpick and which doors require unique keys. So, that, that door is apparently a lockpick door. So, yeah, but a lot of enemies... Uh, a lot of, some of the bosses and some of the enemies just do not choreograph their attack. They're just standing there, standing there, standing there, then... Boom! There, there's the attack. It's like, okay, you could have actually animated something there, but, yeah, okay, I guess I'll just... Nice. I, even, yeah, I, even I can't... I still can't get up there. Bile vessel. Yeah. Apparently it's important. It's a quest item, I guess. Strange glass container. I mean, more interesting what's in it, but okay. Whee. I wouldn't ask what's in it. I think I got stuck. All right, there we go. Um, I wouldn't ask with bile, clearly. All right, let's go down, I guess. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Just look at you while I do this. Are we playing Castlevania now? Hey, hey there, Parker. Check the whole room. Four hundred money. Wow, that's no, enough money to buy it. wool or no. something. No. Oh, wait a minute. This is a, this is a special room. No. This was not in the demo. In fact, I don't think that lockpick was in the demo. I think I wasn't able to get the lockpick. I think that was further than the game. Because I don't remember the cat. I think the cat wasn't. Anything involved with the lighthouse wasn't finished. So I don't think there was cat. I don't think there was lockpick. So I couldn't. Originally we couldn't Damn. get here. So this so is technically it was a much worse game since it didn't have a cat. I think the main thing that throws me off, and Cairo, Cairo will resonate with this. We. This is how the game works. 
You're on a you're on a ship, a British ship. Everybody's uh, Al. Could you live for a second? Thanks. Um, everybody is just on a British pirate ship. There's like British are like just taking pirates back or whatever, and then one of the pirates is a witch, and she like knock gets everybody. She just causes complete chaos by. Uh, I'm gonna kill myself. She just causes complete chaos by turning everybody into rats, and that is an interesting plot hook. But then you just kind of plays one of the prisoners, and the captain's like, alright, you need to arrest my son, and everybody's just kind of getting on with it. It's really kind of disorienting for me, I must say. Also, you don't even have a Poco, so, like, that, and, wait, no, you do have a Poco, okay. But, yeah, it's just, it's, it's weirding me out, because everybody's just like, oh, okay, I guess we'll just get on with life on the, sh you know, our ship got wrecked and we're rats, but we're not gonna have, like, an existential crisis or anything about it, we're just gonna get on with it. Okay, I found a drawing. Oh, we're on the right path. Trolley. Oh, there's all the the people. <laughs> I didn't know what they want to do with me, but they are very mean and smelly. <laughs> Being rats is cool. I mean, it is, but like, there's no psychological aspect to it whatsoever, and it just feels like a missed opportunity. Wait, let's we'll choose this pitch again. Okay, I have no idea what this place is all about. Wait, what it's happened to the map? What just happened to the map? Yeah. Uh, Okay, well, I mean, it'll fix itself in a minute, but that's weird. Hmm. I got him. I guess we did. I could do that. I can't. Hold on. I could do that. Oh. <laughs> yeah, now we're in a weird spot where, like, I have an extra attack option, and you have an extra movement option. And one of those is better than the other in a Metroidvania. Yeah. Agreeable statement. Okay. So it's like, okay, I guess I just have the wrong character. Also, ledger grabbing is like super inconsistent, I just want to say. That was bad. There. There. Now I'll just kind of... Hang out. Am I being attacked by a chef? Yeah, he's You terrible. can let me in. Oh! <laughs> I think I cheated then, yeah. didn't I? This no, was not a place where you're supposed to go. Alright, fair enough. <laughs> what are the other characters give for Dash? We could switch them to find out. Oh, that's an exit? Alright. Sure. Yeah. Sam. Is it really gonna be tasty if it's been in water, though? in the chest. Oh, let's go back down, actually. Or maybe not. What do you think? Down or up? <laughs> I don't know. Pick a direction. Go. Okay, up, up. Just go. Just go. The music stops here. Room. Is this a boss? Yeah, definitely. And we're in a sequence broke, so this boss could be harder than it should be. Yeah. I hate your voice. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Those crunchy little bones are mommy's favorite. Will they be sweet or salty? I can't wait anymore to find out. Shoo! No, Shoo! Stop me from finding Flora. Not even you, Taco. Okay. Oh, oh that's okay. good. <laughs> Thanks. Oh. Tentacles don't cause me damage, right? Okay. Very good. Oh, there go our old souls. This is the TF first. Two. No, there's just animals that are animals. How much do you keep? <laughs> if I can press up. 1403. <laughs> you're going through like three different menus. This is faster to check. Just point that out. <laughs> Well, let's go find the save point that's inevitably around that area. Well, we can teleport somewhere. Ow. Play with you is fun just to watch you get fucked up over and over again. <laughs> wow! <laughs> oh, you know what? <laughs> <laughs> trying to stop me, I see. If you really want to stop me, you should have tried to stop my double jump there and maybe fall. 
Oh, so you could check. Oh, don't check. Do you want to check the other characters? What? Because if we do, that money might, that experience might disappear. Do we want to test that? Oops, I accidentally opened the menu. Wow. I, I guess we can't continue any further to the left. <laughs> <laughs> Is the other player Esther? Yes. <laughs> it kind of sounds like a D and D YouTuber I watch now. That Dester does? No. No, Look, it's wool. It. Material of this quality can only come from some magical and sacred place no. where the sheep, sheep, sheep live happily and compose love songs. Leave it there. <laughs> Give it back to them. But they're happy sheep. Well, not anymore. <laughs> you monster. <laughs> Okay, so my objective would be to warp down there, then head up, and then... Interesting, we found two entrances in the lot but do you think it blocks us up in both? Whistles innocently hiding shears. We'll play a little bit longer on this, guys. I know we've been going a while, but... I want to catch up the progress, and I, I do feel like we formed a pretty full opinion at this point, though. What? I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Oh, they just kind of blow up then, huh? Okay. I'm still in the air. Wait, what happened to you? I wasn't paying attention. I'm not sure. I was mid-jump, like at the peak of my jump over those spikes, and I died. Apparently, apparently I just did that for style points. I don't know. At least dying doesn't set you back very much unless both players die, because otherwise, oh my god. <laughs> Ah, uh, you know the bats that I got the four dollars. The bats that charge and, and immediately uh, charge you give less experience than the bats that just attack you. I just noticed that. Let's trade that X and see where it goes. Now that we know where the boss of the area is, quote unquote. Assuming there's more than assuming there's not more than one. So that would be down. Yeah, we chose like the exact wrong path. Or the exact right path point, if you're like, speedrunning. Down the other path. To be fair, that was the exact correct path if you want to speedrun. True. But yeah, I'm really good at that. I tend to find the paths that don't lead me to a save point. So, yeah. Oh, okay, that's. Oh, whoa, there's two of them. Oh. You know, the exits have a really large hitbox. What the hell was that attack? Did you see that melee attack it has? Not really. It's too busy punching. Hey, bye. <laughs> what was that about? Level up. <laughs> Guess I'll fall and die, said the octopus. <laughs> oh, so yeah, there's... Oh. Oh, there's the lighthouse key. Sacred walls are like impossible to figure out. So I guess this is an area where you're supposed to come to. I don't know if we actually secrets broke that area or if we just secrets we definitely broke. Did. Or we just secrets broke into a layer part of it, right up to the boss. Also, yeah, I noticed the octopus is a physical attack. If it decides to melee, not that one. It did a melee attack that was literally like insta frame. I was just like, what the fuck, man? It's when they're on the wall, I think. They do it. Oh, shit. So you just got complimented, by the way. Kyra says you're like a YouTuber he watches. That means well, you have a good voice, probably. Good. I think you do. I would prefer if I sounded like a, a streamer that he watched. <laughs> and if that streamer was me. <laughs> <laughs> he does, Gaster does stream, guys. He, he's been trying to do it a little bit more. Try to give him some love when he streams. You can find out his streams on my Discord channel. Uh, we have a streamer section where people can just mention that they're streaming. He does that there, so. Keep an eye on that, if you're curious. Just finished the La Mulano run. Then I'm gonna do another. Forever. Forever? Yeah, forever. He's gonna be a sole La Mulana streamer, I guess. <laughs> Certain animals love them as a snack. Okay. Randomizer, I should specify. Randomizer, yeah, you are randomizing. Ow. What makes them decide I'm going to drop now? 
Oh, for fuck's oh, okay. sake. Well, Listen, it's, like it's not my fault, okay? The, it's a huge area that just immediately teleports you out of the room. Like, that is honestly... I don't know why they made those... The, the load, like, if you go for that, you're... Very, yeah, yeah, you're on the edge there, though. You know? Okay, so bosses... Let's go towards the boss. Oh, that's... I just, know that oh. is... That one was real obvious. Because it depends on the room type. Sapphire necklace? It's a so what is thing. what is it determining? Here's a weird thing. Like, I thought the treasure bank was for key items, but key items are showing up in our inventory, too. Not... <laughs> <laughs> Elegant with necklace really with not really an use. <laughs> like what? <laughs> That's a weird sentence. Okay. With not really an use. Good. <sighs> Sank into an ocean of deep secrets. So like any ocean, <laughs> like <laughs> specifically an ocean of deep secrets, not one of those shallow oceans that have no secrets. <laughs> Because they're really shallow. Be and not, and not, I, I don't even know. Oh, hello. Ah, these enemies are really fair with how they just come out with their projectiles, huh? All the way up. I saved you. You're welcome. How, how tall is this room? I am welcome. The answer is yes, by the way. Okay, there it is. So that goes to the boss. Let's go ahead, not okay. to the boss, uh, but like... Wait. We should go to the room to the right, and it's probably a safe room. So we'll probably link up. But there's like a room to the right, right there. That's Fine. like probably the safe room. Fine. It's not. And now we're going down a new path. So there we go. Oh, music. Singing music. Voices. Lyrics. Not lyrics, just singing. It's probably on this path, is the safe room. Yeah, I thought so. This oh, 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 shit, you again. I was like, this feels like an area transition. I was right. Later. See, my path made more sense, sir, because we would have connected this together and that would have cleared up something. Uh, but the other part of this path is where the save room is. To find other, sir. <laughs> this block. Room. I was gonna say, if that was a boss room. <laughs> kind of How? Like, like right next to the other one? We've seen are, bosses. Are you, are you serious? Wait. You've made a Metroidvania, you put a waterfall suspiciously next to a wall. That we can and go there's through. Nothing here. That we can go through as well for some weird reason. How dare you? Oh, by the way, uh, another thing that anybody who recently joined, including Cairo, missed uh, we got a key item to rescue some suspicious people in a cage. We rescued them, we got cutscenes. And then we literally lost all of our money, every bit of it. And I don't know if you get it back. I, I wouldn't be surprised if we don't, honestly, at this point. So yeah, that's fun. Like I get that there's games where, oh no, evil people, they stole your money. But usually you get it back, or it's like, where am I? Dead. Oh, there's an enemy down there. Yeah. Do you want to, again, as I was commenting earlier, the foreground is not fair. Do you agree with me now? You kind of like actually said yeah. it was fine before. I don't think so. I think there's too many foreground elements. Case in point. The only reason I knew that was there is because you died to it. Okay, so we've, we've reconnected the path. Let's go back. I told you this was a Yeah, path. The, I guess I, I it's weird, weirdly I was more chill about it in the demo, probably because it was the demo, but... Then again, it's like, it's a, that's not a glitch. That's just what they wanted to do with the game. So it raises the question of, yeah, it, do you not get that back? Do you get it back later? I mean, like, here's the thing, though. If they don't give it back soon, it's going to be kind of pointless at that point. It's like, well, okay, but I got my money back because I thought it was... Because I think most players, if they don't get their money back immediately in a situation like that, they're going to be like... I'm helping. He's targeting me. He's a wall. Oh, Fuck. never mind. You got too closer. Rebrand from Haller for an hour to whole stream. Well, no, I don't think I'd go that far. There's a very, there's actually a very specific reason too. 
Even so, uh, there's if I don't go through all the Haller games, that's fine. We're gonna do more. I'm gonna do another Haller for an hour for you soon. More. There's the fucking save room. It was now. It was down the path that neither of us pointed to. Whose turn is it? Uh, I need 2,400 for my next thing, which is like a ton. Does I answer the question to go for it? thing though. Yeah. That's she, that's the, that's not really a problem I need to worry about though for the future, so we're gonna have plenty of souls after we defeat the boss. Oh no That's the situation. <laughs> <laughs> I like how it's invincible while it's falling. That's really fun, isn't it? Just not being able to hit it enemy for no good reason. Also, all the way down, actually. Okay. I forgot this path was a path we didn't take. Ah. Uh, just enough. Sweet. <laughs> we victory. I really don't like it when it costs money. Like, Are we ever going to use that? Shrug? It's good to have it, though. You never know. Dude, don't... Uh, this, since this game has been willing to steal my money, you know what I, it also is probably willing to do? Backtrack quests. Hey, can you go to that old area and like just pick up an item so we can pat out the end of the game? So yes, the teleport might be useful. Uh -huh. Like, where have we seen a path that we haven't been able to go to? It hurt me while I was dying. Okay, good to know. <laughs> good. Of course it can. Also, it is one of those situations though, like... We can't really get our souls back without fighting the boss, which is kind of shitty, but... Yep. I'm just gonna call them souls, because that's what it is. Where, wait. Oh, hi. I guess it despawned again. Did you see our souls? No. They're gone! For some reason. Alright, I'm gonna unpause. Three, two... One. I'm already in the middle of the case. I knew it. If you stand to the other side of them, they don't attack you properly. They also don't take much, actually. Alright. Well, they did hurt him a little bit. Someday I'll learn the timing. Oh, okay. And it hit me an extra time, too. Watch out. No. I gotta activate my damage. Wait, okay. So that's very damaging, but the tentacles are stupid and they don't. You, you focus that. Yeah, I like yeah. how you're cutting them with your punches, by the way. Very yeah. impressive. Watch out above! I can't. I'm still in the middle of a, an attack animation. Well, don't. <laughs> I don't know. I can't jump! Because I'm still in the middle of an attack animation. It's okay, I win. See if I can glitch the boss again. What a pile of octopus. What the fuck is that fucking... What's that? Okay. It's Galizia, damn it! What the hell is Galizia? What do we get for that? A hook. Uh, a couple... Oh, hey, we got one of the pirate parts for that one guy's side quest. Oh, so this is a side quest boss, I guess? Alright. We probably should consider switching games now, though. Let's, uh... We got our... No, we, we, didn't right, we, stuff, we did successfully do the stuff that was in the demo, like you wanted. Souls Vanger maybe like to use in level shop. I I think you're right, but also that's bullshit. Unless no, I don't think it's doing that. Unless you're able to reclaim your souls at a level shop, but that doesn't make any sense because that's where you die, spawn when you die, anyways. Actually, I don't know where we're going. Let's let's go back. Let's go back to the save room to save. 
and stuff. Because right, if we go to the next save room, then we'll be close to the next boss, and then we can just do that before we end. And then, you know, why don't we just go to the next save room, so that that's a good point. But then I we'll mean, be next to the next boss. It's fun enough, but the fact that we've lost both of the main resources, one through a glitch and one through unfair game design, it just kind of rubs... It, Rubs slightly the wrong way, I have well, to say. I agree with Xerix's opinion on the situation. What did he say? You were so cute, Esther. Fair enough. <laughs> I like how when the clam dies, it goes, Egh! It's like, okay, that's definitely a clam sound. When you know, a clam dies, they go, Egh! That's just what clams do, you know? Oh, we're in yeah. the wrong room. Wait, wait, yeah, wait. Are we in the wrong room? Uh, Fuck no, if I know. Right place. What? This is the right place. Would it be so hard for the map markers to, like, stay in the rooms that they're supposed to be in? I don't know. Oh, he's not there. Oh, okay. He just has the ability to move into the place where you can't see him. Yes, magically, Esler, enemies can, in fact, move sometimes. Isn't that crazy? Also, no, we are the in the wrong place. See, I, see, it's so hard to tell! Why can't the XP a little more position the Oh, oh here's a crazy... To show our here's a crazy... In the room. Here's a crazy fucking idea. Um, how about our player icon be, like, not fucking ginormous so we can tell where it is? <laughs> Rather than a ballpark estimate. Uh, no, they, they make it so that it shows the exact wrong button. The exact position of us. So we're in the ceiling? No? Okay, never mind. So we're in the ceiling, Esler? We're in the ceiling right now? We're right here? We're in the black space oh, above me? Okay, so that just makes no sense then. Yeah, exactly! This is not the first Metro... We actually played a Metro area recently. Remember the one with the weird... Sp what was that one called? Um, I played it offline. It was the one uh, that I recently hollered that involved switching heads. And you play oh, as like yeah, a green yeah. spidery uh, thing. Uh, I forgot the name uh, of it already. Let me check again. Somebody. Zappling? Zap yeah, Zappling. Zappling. Bygone. Bygone Zeppelin. And that thing didn't know what the fuck it was doing with the map guy gun either. It's so weird to me how many people are uh, develop Metroidvanias where the map doesn't tell you what it's supposed to. In Zeppelin Bygone, your icon only moved occasionally, and it could literally, literally be like at the bottom of an area when you're actually at the top. It was so fucking confusing. It, it actually made, was worse than not having a map. Because if you don't have a map, at least then you're kind of like mapping something in your head. But that literally told you the wrong information. Yeah, what is up with... Like, this isn't as bad as happening Bygone, but... Can I get that? Yeah. Cool. So this is why this character is ridiculous. Free projectiles! Free yeah. projectiles! Now I can stay back, you can fight things up close, and I can just do this. <laughs> yeah, now, like, you stay back, you stay safe, why rush in, beat their faces. No, the range is not... Yeah, it just yeah. keeps going. Like, it just goes. So you never die, and I just ram my face into the enemy. There you go. Take all the aggro. Anyways, we'll come back to this at some point. Uh, Esther's only going to be here for, like, another week, uh, and then he's going to be going back. We're, we're still trying to arrange uh, him living here. There's still some stuff we got to work on, but he definitely will be involved in more co-op uh, once he is more stably here as well. So maybe we can get in some more sea rats before he goes. We'll see. Um, I mean, 25%. This might be doable in another session. Huh. Maybe a session and a half. Or maybe I don't know. It depends. Sessions. I mean, map, map completion doesn't necessarily determine game completion. True. But... But if we 100 percent it, I feel like a large part of Me Metro Vegas time is, hey, let's open the map. Uh, 100 percent it, that may be tricky though, because secret rooms. Again, if they don't give us an item for that, I don't know. I don't. I don't have a lot of faith in this game's game design, besides being generally competent. Because I mean, it stole money for me. That's not a good game design choice. Not in the way they did it, at least. Again, other games can steal money from you, but they usually give it back shortly after. It's just like, oh, it's a thief. It's starting there to purpose. But then it doesn't actually affect you. Like, I can think of Paper Mario. Isn't, wasn't there a thief that just steals all your money, but then you get back slightly after? It's like, okay. Not a big deal. But yeah. Um, so we might play this again uh, at some point when we can. Curse of the Sea Rats, I gotta say, disappointing. It has fantastic presentation. I mean, the areas look nice, the art uh, looks nice. Like, I as think long as you don't read any. Cairo made the best thing. It, it seems like a game where the illustrators are focused and not the programmers. 
it looks great. Or the writers. Or the writers. The writers, the writers is kind of there. Because, again, it's so weird that it's just like, oh, I guess we're rats. We're not going to really address it. We're just going to be rat people. Like, it feels like if you had just rewritten the start of this game to be, so this is 1777, uh, and everybody's just rats. Everybody's just animals. <laughs> And then just had the plot be otherwise the same. It would have just... It would change nothing. It would change almost nothing. People turning into rats doesn't seem like much of a fucking point. There's not much of a plot point to that besides... That's how Flora Byrne got a, escaped, I guess, but... It kind of feels like if you just had this be a furry world in the first place, it wouldn't really change the plot. And then she used magic to make the ship crash. And I'm a little... I'm sorry, I like transformation themes. But part of the reason I like transformation themes in games is when you get to the psychological aspect of it. Like, oh god, I'm a rat or something, you know? Or just the idea that some might go crazy, some might have to, like, come to terms of it and deal with it. Like, that's all interesting stuff. So if you're going to use a no, transformation rats theme... Now and everyone's fine. You're using a mass transformation theme, and you're not really using it, though. That's what I see out of this game. Which is a bit of a shame, narratively. Gameplay-wise, it's fine. It's a bit stiff in controls. Um... It's fine relatively for gameplay, but yeah, it's it's presentation kind of suffers, and it could be better. There's a lot of refinement that should have happened from the demo nine months ago to now that didn't happen. Maybe they'll refine it later, but it still it still leaves a bad taste in my mouth. Even if they do pass patch in the future, I understand if a game has no demo whatsoever and then releases and then has to patch because people start playing it then upon full release or early access or whatever. Right now, it doesn't even exist in early access. It is not available right now. I, can, I played an early version here. But yeah, if, if something has no demo whatsoever, releases, and then people are like, hey, we found some bugs, understandable to patch then. Completely get it. And it's understandable to patch all the time, but if something has a demo release months in advance, that is a huge opportunity to patch all the major bugs and refine things out. Um, and if you don't take that opportunity, I, I consider that to be a bit lazy uh, from a development standpoint. Uh, bit of a shame. Maybe they got forced to push out the door. I don't know what their publisher is like, but it is a bit of a shame. Uh, hopefully they do approve it, because with a few more refinements, it would be a little bit more acceptable. It's got some quibbles, but it's still a fun game, I'd say. Just not perfect. It's, not, it's definitely, I think I'd give it like a 7 out of 10, maybe. It's like completely competent. It's just lack of refinements. Poor narrative present presentation and quibbles here and there. I'd probably give it a seven, which is not a terrible score of mine. I'd but give it a six. Give it a six. Do you want maybe even a five? Probably because I was playing the the character that gets stuck in animations constantly and then dies. True. You were having problems because one, the D pad controls are literally broken. Yeah, they they literally do. And not you prefer D pad in this situation. Yeah. So. Um. And you were playing, and you also were experiencing the disbalance between characters, which is another one of those refinement things I'm talking about. Like, the I characters are literally not equal. that you did. They're not created equal. Like I could do that sidestep to get through areas, yeah. and you cannot use. I that. just can't. You I, just fall, I don't right? have that option. You just fall as you're doing. Yeah. It, the only thing that changes is that I'm stuck moving in that direction, and I have a, a, a hurt box. So yeah, it gave me its polish, but also there's just. Hard mechanical decisions made purposely in the game that I don't agree with, such as the character disbalance, the hurt boxes on enemies being very inconsistent uh, and just existing at all, and the fact that like we can like the money decision, like have those people rob you. That just kind of fucking sucks, man. It's not even like it, I don't know. I, it's hard. To, it's, in my opinion, it's hard to justify the ha ha. Let's rob the player of their money. For a narrative reason, like kind of there's some ways to do it right, but I don't feel like they did it right because I mean we're not. I haven't seen the money. Maybe we'll to get it back. To be fair, it was very obvious that they were evil. Yeah, but you didn't, you probably wouldn't expect that result. I don't know. But regardless, uh, Chris C. Right, yeah, seven out of ten, five or six out of ten for him. We'll come back to this and probably hundred hundred percent it or come close to it if it's the secret rooms are really fucking annoying. <gasps> There might be a map, though, for that. <laughs> Hopefully, somebody's made one by then. Uh, but yeah, it's not too bad. Um, it's just, it, again, much like I feel like a lot of Metrovania's released these days, it's like, that's, it's fun, but it could easily be more fun if it just had a little bit more focus, direction, refinement, polish, and gets better direction. So, yeah, Curse of the Sea Rats. I suggest maybe playing it when it is on sale. This hasn't been released yet, so I don't know what its release price will be, but I'm going to guess it's going to be... 40-ish dollars. I feel like this is going to be a 40-ish dollars game, actually. 
Kind of feels like it, it will be. I don't know, though. But I would say probably wait for it to be on sale before picking it up. Then probably could enjoy it if you enjoy a good Metrovania. But yeah, that was Curse of the Sea Rats. I hope you guys enjoyed.